And we're live. Hello and welcome. And we are back with our C block campaign. This is today a short stream. Well, let's see how that goes, but it's a stream nonetheless. Whether it will be short, we'll leave that to uh, to the end to tell whether it became a short stream or just a normal stream. I just really uh, felt like playing today. So I want to get some traction on this. We have our ECBs, so electronic circuit boards. So everything is going to be great today. Well, we have some uh, people in the community who have built some pretty amazing things. And I got totally envious of, of the amazing work they've done. That Did I seriously? I took half of them and there was 400. Nice. So I have a few things that I want to build today. This is our base. This is just the overview. Well, let's, um, let's recap where we are. The base has sort of stabilized at a certain size. However, coal is the big problem. You can see here, it's just not generating enough. And I really need to scale it up for sure. How we do that, I don't quite know because I am actually also building here. If I, I think it's actually this one that's really causing the, the headache. If I look at this one, this one should stop. And then these guys uh, might not want to s complete all of this. Because right now I'm just producing. I, I think that might actually be because I'm I'm producing way too much plastic. It's, it's unbelievable to be able to say that. But it is actually too much plastic. What? Suddenly no viewers? Did, did I go offline? Stop streaming? Am I still here? Really? Is it offline? Okay, maybe I'm just uh, sitting here playing not with myself. Not, not sitting here playing with myself. I'm playing for myself. There is a distinct difference between the two. Right, good. I'm, I'm still alive. Right, so might as well take this one and just cap it at methanol. Because I think this is the genuine problem. Less than 100,000. There. Right? And this is now stopped. And then these wells will gradually fill up. That one is... This is my residual gas that I somehow need a bit... How's this one doing? This is, ah, this, the old, age old, sorry, hey, BFX. Okay, uh, this is going to be 15. And I just need to get the icons back. Every time I stop using it, mod, it goes back to default. And if Angel was here, I would tell him, kindly, not firmly, to make this the default options. Because why would you not want scaling and then we need to reload the entire map. Right. So really it is, um, it is the, how many games do you have? Uh, what do you mean? How many games? Games of Factorio? Games of games on Steam? I currently have my belts and blocks active. Oh, it was it the load? Oh, I, I I think I might have overdone my uh, my <laughs> my save games, <laughs> but they are at least consistent. Oh, look at these! These are some really old ones. That's my first Angel series. It would be even fun to take a look at it sometime. I think I'll do that for some kind of anniversary. That would be fun. All right, let's jump down. Well, we are on on. This is C plug is actually uh, season sixteen, so that's uh, sixteen seasons, and I can tell you the first ones are not the same level of quality that we see. That I hope we see today. That one's good. This one's full. Okay, we're definitely getting enough. So this one will jam soon. It will. This one will run down to one hundred thousand, and this one will stop, and that means these belts will. They keep running. Why are they keep running? Okay, it's slowly building up, but it'll turn yellow soon and then it'll back up all the way. Okay, now we'll start again. 
So far, this hasn't changed anything. I definitely need to scale this one up. Uh, this one, I can't make any higher rank of algae farms, unfortunately. Is there algae? Oh, no, there isn't anything. This one's ammonia. Oh, this is crazy. What is the use for? Calcium carbonate. Okay, that's for my alien research. That's very, very late. Uh, green research is done. Why do you have that amount of worlds? Um, because I played for over 2,000 hours, and that's a bit much to have in a single game. Let's see. Paste is completely irrelevant. Paste is not used for anything except these things. So I don't need to research paste. I don't need to research electrolyzer. Might at some point. It doesn't lead anything into anything. Uh, what do I want? Thermal water extraction not needed either. I mean, we are, we are pretty much done with red and green signs. So it is also about making the blue signs, but not quite yet, because I feel that I'm not ready for it. What I really need to do is first fix the coal production or, well, I think a good place to start is actually doing some landfill. Landfill you can never have enough of. Then I do not take all of it because when I just miss it, teeny tiny bit then i have it all right so where is a good place to expand okay that's one more what's the first one that could actually have a usage this one oh this one does have a usage because it's for not for nukes but it's actually leading really isn't it why is this not leading to anything useful so this one's not leading to anything useful Trains, highly doubt that's going to be relevant. Grinding, we are polishing, we need that. I guess down here could be an option. The difference between the Angel's cargo bots, Mark 1 and Mark 2, is definitely the speed. That makes a huge difference, because they are a tad slow. Oh, I picked up some fishies. And I will make something like this. Oops, I have to go to one. There. Let's start with the easy one, this one. I'll keep it going all the way over here. Just because it's gonna suck if I miss it. This might actually be too far, now that I think of it. Oh, how I wish there was a way for me to do this more efficiently, but nope, nope, there isn't. Because I will not accept losing half of it. They get a massive speed upgrade. That's really the whole point of using them. Couldn't this be done in a car? Because things that I do in the car, what could possibly go wrong? The car can actually drive straight lines. So, yeah. Much faster. Ooh, that was so close. And then see if I can turn. Can? Cool. Turn it straight. I mean, what could possibly go wrong with me in a car? Ah, oh, don't even get me started on car trouble. I've had a huge fight with Tesla today. Because they, um, when they put on my wind, winter, winter tires on my car, they put on some flat winter tires. Thank you. So they were gradually losing, losing pressure and they refused to come pick it up. They said, yeah, I can just come there midday on Thursday. And I was like, no, I'm not going to come there on a midday Thursday. Then I have to take an entire day off just to come. Because you, oops, uh, did some, forgot this. And I'm probably doing, making too big an area to cover her. And reversing is not fast enough. All right, so, and also I have a special agreement with Tesla, so I'm supposed to be treated as a premium customer, but they weren't. And so today, this morning, I went out to the car and it was completely flat, not even just, uh, it was red lights uh, on the warning lamp, so I'm not allowed to drive it at all. 
So I had to get it picked up and they picked it up, but they didn't bring a loaner to me. So I was stuck at home without a car and I had to pick up the kids in the afternoon and they just didn't seem to care. And so I had to call the Nordic service director and he was very, very friendly, you must say that, and just complaining at how inefficient the Danish service center was. So, but anyway, I mean, he, uh, he yelled at them and they got their act together. So now I got my car back, all fixed up, new, uh, new wheels on it, or at least one. And also cleaned, polished, vacuumed, all that good stuff. So that's nice. But it would be nice not to be to have to retort to escalation for for just a basic basic service. Anyway, um, or after the landfill change, I don't know what landfill change there is. I am Danish, that's for sure. And I hate my Danish accent. I'd love to get rid of it, but that doesn't seem to be feasible. That was actually one of my points of starting YouTube, just to get some more casual, casual practice speaking. And well, we do get the practice, but still. Oh, that's a landfish. Gotta tag him, they are my pets. Oh, that's another one. Eh, hey, like them. We still have a bit left, so we should be able to get some more coverage out here. That's another landfish. You know what? I should probably do this. I wonder if I shoot the fish now. Ah, you shoot too. Uh, you're too rough on the fishies. It's just supposed to be a love tap, not, nothing more. All right. Proper Denmark or backup? Hmm. You mean basically my options are Northern Germany or or pseudo Sweden? I guess that's my two options I have. All right. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm doing landfill cheating now. Otherwise, I wouldn't get any landfish, and that's half the point. I'm getting so many landfish in this setup. It has been sort of like... The theme of this campaign has been capture the landfish. I need more ground, and that's just why. More space to work on. It's not that bad, and then I can talk about random stuff. Whoa! You what? My brush in Factorio is too it so can't do landfill abuse. Well that's if it was landfill abuse they would have fixed it. It's like so many other things. It's just something that you can use if you have a bit more experience and know it. I like those kind of things. I like it. I like it. Oops, why am I nanobots? Yep, go. Go nanobots. I can't really look at the chat while uh, landfilling. I'm gonna have to cut that in two because I need to get back, but I just don't need nowhere. Come on. All right, this is unfortunately not much space to work on because I'm building too big here. I'm getting kind of worried that I'm overdoing this. I don't think it's really that necessary. Oops, the car. I wonder if I could do this from the map view. Oh, 
would be interesting if we could do it from the map view. Let's just give it a shot. Yeah, we can do it, but it doesn't work. No, 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 no. What if I zoom in really close? Ah! Can't do it from map view. I'll try it. Oh, that's a massive, massive discovery. That here. That is a massive discovery. Seems like just one of them gets lost, but that's fine. The last one? Yep. Okay. You thought they nerfed it, and that started my C-Blank by filling in fully manually a single spot. Okay, well, that's... Um, you can always start over if you like. It's always an option. All right. Uh, this is a nice, nice speed of filling in. This is so much nicer. Uh, yeah, okay, look the other way, because you might be... It might be too much flickering here. I don't know if this is uh, seizure inducing. How much do we have left? E? Ah, uh, not much. A couple of thousand. Oh, I'm not close enough. What the hell? All right, this is pretty good. And what do you think about shiny angel and shiny Bob? I don't like it. Very, very simple, don't like it. I think the icons are ugly. I think the, yeah, I, I just don't like it. it uh, I don't think, I mean, Angel has done such an amazing work on the graphics. So just making, painting all of them yellow is ugly as hell. So I don't like it. Um, and that's why I don't use it. It's also, of course, a matter of I've gotten used to this and therefore I really prefer that way. I'm old school. I like my, uh, like my things, like the, the way they always have been, always will be. And there. It's disaster. Oh no, I can't do it. I need to be out here. CDO isn't CC thing. It's just OCD when you're not real OCD. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. It's it's the internet, the uh, internet OCD. But you should be happy about it. Anyway, I'm not restarting my C-Log now. I've gotten this far. And yes, starting that is enough to get started. Of course it is. I mean, it would be strange if it, if you had to do, let's say, clever use of game mechanics. That's what I'm going to call it. This is going to end. Oh no, this is not going to end well. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Need to start from here. Okay, over here, I need, to, of course, need to fix this the fact that it went outside of the bounds here. One, one, good. It didn't go up, but you can't say what, see what. No, you can't, but you don't need to. You can look at them. You can click on them. Like so many other things in Angel we trust. If he says that's the way they're supposed to look, then I'm not the one who... I'm definitely not the one to correct him. I do know very little about what graphics should look like. There we go. Is that 
Correct? Yes. All right, then we have a bit of space. What else do we need? It's actually amazing that we still have a bit left. All right, let's uh, put it back where we got it. Open the box, get it back. Good. Now, let's get some landfill or some stone bricks because that is the next thing we want. Let's actually take the car, let's get a bit better. So, Mariel, Mar Bariel. Okay, so you're from uh, that part of the country. Are you? Do you know that there are two and a half million more Germans in uh, in Denmark in Jutland than there are Danes? Yes, two and a half million. It was a surprising uh, revelation to me, but it, it actually uh, it's it's quite a lot more than I thought. I thought there might be a lot, but yeah. There are four and a half million. Uh, if you look at the Jutland Wikipedia site, it says there are four and a half million Germans in Jutland and two million Danes. So that must make it two and a half million more Germans than Danes in Jutland. I mean, I know there are a lot on vacations there, but two and a half million, that's, that's a lot. I'll even paste you the link. I'll uh, just copy this image. Uh, let's just paste it here. There, if you look at the right hand side in that uh, fact, uh, fact box, then uh, you can see it says four and a half million Germans and two million uh, Danes. So that was a surprise to me as well. By the way, after Shandibub appeared on Mod Portal, Angel changed his icons so we can see different. Mark also icons and building paint in yellow like it. Yeah, so I'm going with Angel on this one. See, there's a little two here. One, two. I like that. It's it's very clean, crisp, and anyway. Right, I haven't really started working on anything. What is it we want to build? I think I want to build something like this one, but just build it bigger and better. Right? Let's just see if this one... You're still building. Why are you still building? Oh, we're down to 77. Damn. But you should be stuck. You should be. Ah, uh, that one. That's actually be the one being consumed here. Right, so we're not actually. And let's see. What is it we need most at this point? I think I know. It's not actually something down here. This is a great space for me to work on, but it's not exactly what I need the most. What I need the most is actually... Okay, let's see. What I need more than anything at this point is faster robots. And in order to make faster robots, I need electric engines. So let's make electric engines. That means we need engines. Yeah, yeah, of course I'm ignoring you. We'll build it down here. Okay, jump out. This uh, blueprint here, I have it up here. What? Okay, there. There, and go robots. I have to move everything to these locations and that means also all the stuff that I like building, I have to build it here as well. Okay, so this one will be engines. 
How does it feel to live in a monarchy? It's not really a big difference living in a monarchy than living in a republic. It it basically just means that we have a a state sponsored PR department that we can't fire. And that's about it. That's all the difference it makes. I mean we don't have celebrities as way as US does, but our royalty is our celebrities, so we follow their ups and downs and mostly their downs. Right. So if I want to make engines, I need gears and pipes also up here. So why don't we just start from one end and say, first, we need to make gears. That needs 500. And I'll just make 1000 gears. Copy paste. This is kind of my default setup when it comes to production. And here I'll make pipes, iron pipes. 500 here. And this one will be pipes as well. Because once I have these pipes, I can then make engines, but I can't make the engines until I have this part. And the next one, go. These also need to be crafted, obviously. Now engines, how many engines should I make? And now I'm going to go a bit overboard, but I'm just going to say, whatever. I'll just need a thousand. Ah, that is crazy. We're going to be totally modest here. 500. Totally modest on this. And engines. Go, go, go. And I've need to craft more copy paste and paste five hundred of everything that's much simpler right next one I want to make might as well just keep going with some of the things that I totally need to craft craft here the first one obviously being assembly machines and assembly machines mark two This one will make Mark 1 machines. Yep. And we'll take another one to make Mark 2 machines right there. One. And what are we missing? We are missing iron, of course. Where's the big box? The big box is here. Iron, 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 iron. All right, this one will now make blue, copy, paste. I will not have as many. I'll take 500 of these. Ah, you know what? I'm not going to take 500 of those. I'm going to take 200 because anything less makes no sense. And 200, that's ah, crazy. This one will make, how many? Oh, hold on. This is wrong. This is wrong. Get away. Go away. Because there's a different way of doing it. That is fine for things that are mass produced. However, for things that are in tiers, I should build it differently. I should make it in a much more clever way that I might just do up here. And then I guess the whole damn thing comes crashing down. Basically. I'm going to make that one. I could actually make it different, couldn't I? And uh, yeah, I think Mamma that um, the Danish monarchy is uh, is a lot cheaper than the English democracy or English monarchy. That for us, it, it serves basically the same purpose. It represents the country outwards. Right, so I think I'll need to make sort of like a series somehow like this, where I make one, make the other. 
and make tier 3. How are we then going to do it? We are going to take Requester here, Requester, Requester, and put that in. Right? So, inbound. Flip it like this. Like this. Copy. Here, here, here. There. It works, it works, it works. And what I need, okay. I actually, I'm fairly certain our democracy is less economically beneficial to us than the... Well, the English monarchy has a, a, a different sort of income because the British monarchy owns a lot of land. And that land has been lent to the state uh, sort of indefinitely, as I recall. And it's not about the tourism. It's simply just the amount of land owned in UK is quite absurd. And that has a tremendous value. If they started uh, just claiming rent for it, that would be a astronomical amount. But anyway, I think that's... Uh, I know I'm just talking about stuff I don't know anything about. Not that it really ever really stops me but uh, I do should be uh, kind of careful. Always should be careful. All right, let's make some of... Let's make the right one. So that's a small one and small one. It's a bit confusing that the small ones are actually bigger. This is a small, this is a big one. I understand why, but it's still confusing. Right, so this one, go here, grab it. We'll take 200 of each. 200 seems like a good number for every, everything here. 500 for that. 200. That's just one load. There we go. The old king is so cool that also loves him and makes him into a god. Oh, that's really nice. I mean, that would be nice to be, be some sort of a deity. But I think that's... Uh, yeah. Less than, what should we do? 10? We don't need much because it can produce just as fast. Copy, paste, paste. This one is going to be... There we go. And then I'll say... Oh, they're not inbound yet. Here, and of course, hook it up, and there. Perfect. Now, we should see something inbound. Ooh, not the gears. Well, the gears are not ready. Are you waiting for a green screen to get a camera? No, I do have a camera, but then it broke, and then I... Once it broke and I streamed, then I found out that I really did enjoy not having a camera on. It was just so nice not having a camera on. It actually made made it much more relaxing, relaxing to stream. And I don't think that I th or basically I think that if I added the camera back on, I would not stream as much. It's just the whole thing about sort of being conscious of what you, what you're doing. Two, are we wasting 200 here? Yes, we are. Oh, look at that. That's a, uh, something needs to be crafted. And there we go. That is probably how it's going to be. And then one, to look at this one. One, two, three. There. These also need to be there. And then I guess this will be more or less of a pattern like this. So now it's ready at least to build all the way. If you input to request it, does it count to what items in the logistics net? If not, those conditions will not work. 
That is absolutely true. That is a really good point. I need a buffer chest. That's exactly what I need. I need a buffer chest. That's a really good idea. Um, then I will, I'll just do it differently. That's a good point. A very good point. Thank you for mentioning it. I will use the red ones here. And I know I should use the blue ones, but it's just, it's so much easier to see what's going on here. That's so obvious. Thank you. Thank you, Exposensi. You are back here to fix my silly mistakes. So, green mark. What? I mean, Greenland is a colony. It is... Yeah, I think it's a... It is kind of a colony, but it's they have independence of some kind, but they're not truly independent. Did you know that there's only one empire on Earth and it's Japan? Nope, I did not know that. And then all the cell-styled emperors. Right, I like this one. And I'm going to build immediately build another one. I mean, it kind of is and it kind of isn't. The whole uh, Denmark and, uh, and Greenland part. Oops, I have to remove these immediately because they will not work. This one will then be something else. What is it going to be? It's going to be those, that one. I actually just for a sense of completion, I think I actually want to do this one. Do I not have any electronic? Not spelling electronic. Electronic assembly machine. There it is. That one. But I should be able to. Oh, right. Right, 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 right. This one just can't make the other ones. I can handcraft them. But I cannot. No, I stopped doing those silly things. Why didn't I craft that? That one. And that one. And that one. Um, I did craft one of these. Yep. Here is where you craft Mark II. Do I want the Mark IIs? Ah, uh, they're too expensive for me now. But anyway, it's, it's nice. It looks nice. Right, what is it? This one, copy, paste, and then I'll just mark it as 50 of these. They're always nice. Copy, paste. What are you needing? You're needing, let's up these to 200. I'm also gonna have to do this for inserters and everything else. But at this point, let's just build it like this first. Good. And it's annoying that I can't run past, but that's, uh, that's just the way it is. Can you get one? Nope. You are waiting, are you, things are inbound, but not. Oh, there we go. And let's build basic electronics board. Those we do have here. Let's build a few more, a few more, and then go down and build something else. This is basically just saying, I now have a place where I can take it. And about equality as, <laughs> Oh, why did this turn into to that? Now that, ooh, look, we have engines. Awesome. Um, then I need to figure out how I make my other engines. Okay, let's see what requires lubricant. And I think I'll do that up here. Lubricant. No, that's not what I wanted. There. Lubricant. What requires lubricant? The express, yes, express loaders. Oh yeah, those as well. Titanium, nitinol, ceramic. Yeah, okay, so there are some things that require this, but not a lot. <laughs> I 
Thank you for the compliment. The uh, cute. Well, I don't know how that's going to be pronounced, but thank you for the compliment. A, a, a most sincere one, I would imagine. I would imagine that you have you know a wealth of Danes, and among all the Danes you know, I somehow rank highest. That is some compliment. Go, 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 go. And let's hook it up. There. Yes, I'm getting it to... Quantum topology. Ooh, quant oh, that sounds that sounds exhilarating. That sounds like something I want to understand, but don't quite understand. I understand enough to understand that I don't understand it. Right. And then we'll do something else. I'll need a pump. So can you in the comments explain quantum topology for us just for the uninitiated? There. Oh no, it actually has to be on. Okay, I'm going to build it. No, if I build it here, then it obstructs the next one. And I expect to have a lot of those. So I do, despite the fact that it's not practical, we'll have it here. Hey, just stumble on on your channel and watch the whole Minute on Ride series in one weekend. Wow, that's a lot. I hope you liked it. How did you, uh, uh, so that you will now participate in my market research. How did you find my channel? Because I'm really interested in how people find my channel because it, it does seem kind of strange somehow or arbitrary or, you know, just not always making a lot of sense how people find my channel. And this is going to be Angels Insert of Spaghetti. That one gonna go from here to there correct yes it is this one just gonna turn around the corner actually this one is the other way around so it goes from here to there yeah works i guess uh just over recommended okay because i'm the reason why i'm so curious about it aside from the fact that i'm always curious on uh, what drives it is that I can see my my vanilla done right is sometimes getting a spike of interest and I mean we do all, all like a spike of interest but it's also very nice to know if this spike is generated by someone making recommendations or it's just randomly that YouTube says hey this guy we haven't haven't been uh, advertising him a bunch lately Why did I set this one, these two? 500, that's a pretty ambitious target, but whatever, we'll do it. There, now we have electric engines, except we don't have electric engines because we do not have any lubricant, but that's the one we're gonna do. So here comes the first part is a study of non-geometrical aspects of spaces such as whether as holds whether they're connected or disconnected whether it looks <laughs> yeah let's take a normal topology and then just throw a quantum at it just for the hell of it I've asked someone else's C block series. A Roomba's? I don't think Roomba has a C block series. Right, next step up is we take the base mineral oil and we need to convert it into lubricant. Let's have a look where we get our lubricant from. That means somehow moved here. That's where we need the residual gas. So I will make that here. Somehow. This will make lubricant. I don't know. I don't think I need a lot. Okay. 
one. Oh, that's only one. This is just such a habit to build them on either side, even if they're not needed. There, that's that part. I will look it up here. And that's another thing we want to build eventually, electric poles. Uh, I found you when you did the angels, Bob Sears and Metallurgy wasn't beta. Okay, cool. That's a, that's a while ago. Uh, quantum topology. Are you sure that XX is the correct term? The 20th century? That's a... Uh, it looks an interesting way of writing it. Oh, what are we missing? We're missing steel gears. That just means steel. Let's grab some more steel. Go, go, go. And let's get a few more of these. I'm definitely needing them. So I need two things coming in that one that one and one thing going out this lubricant come on come on all right let's look at ratios so it's 40 and 10 becomes 50. that means if i can take the output of both of these that'll be the input for the other one yeah so this will basically be the requester for that and I will output here and then, oh, look, this is actually great. You can take it in, out. You can take it in, out. Out here. So they're just gonna cycle back and forth. Here. And you will be taking it in and throwing it over there. Okay, so this one is residual gas. Can I spot residual gas? Yes, I can. I took the wrong one, that one, empty residual, and this is empty base mineral oil. I can't find base mineral oil. There. This one is lubricant in a barrel, that one. I'm going to request 100 of these and 100 base mineral oil. Is that it? Nope. Base mineral oil. Yes, 100. Right, so they go in here, they get put back, and whatever the, all the empty ones that get put back here will be picked up. And there's an, because there's an even ratio, so there's a closed system. And I don't need to add any more barrels to this network or even ferry them back and forth. So this is good, and I will reward you with that one, which is not connected to the rest of the network, but it is now. Look, yes, 60 of those barrels. Is that because of lack of... Nope, it's not lack of logistics bots. It's simply because I only have 60 of those. And why do I only have 60? Because I do not have any coal, and coal is, yeah, the bane of my assistance. Yeah, okay, a time when everyone hated and ignored Metallica and I was hating them back then and I found you who started to use it. I, I was in the same boat. I must admit when Angel, he had his first like in the beta, I tried it and I was like, all right, I'm, uh, I'm not sure. And then he made some changes and I was like, all right, this is just horrible. But at that point, I honestly did not have any subscribers and I saw that no one was playing Angels and Bobs. So I thought, all right, this is my niche. This is the one thing I do. So I did my tutorials and I was so happy I did that. And I think that really kicked things off for me personally. And once, I think there are a lot of things with Angels mods where you look at it and said, oh, that's stupid. But then you actually try it and not just try it, but try it in the way that it is intended. And then you find out that, oh, look, it actually makes really good sense. For example, this silly vehicle, the crawler. First I was driving around and it's so slow and it was breaking everything. But if you don't have nanobots, this is Angel's way of doing nanobots. Basically, you take this giant one, you place it somewhere, you put all the junk you need, 
in the inventory and then you just put it the a construction order and leave then it creates Coke pellets this morning, yay! All right, let's let's actually force some lubricant along because I want to get some. And where do we have that? That's this one. And we just shove it in here. That was probably a mistake because now that's going to be stuck in this network forever. Yay! Is that being picked up? Yes, it is. Look, it's actually this one that's coming. How the hell did you change your... How are you so close? You're probably on your way back to this location. Um, this is my problem. Trying to convince friends that bombing is fun. Not just absurdly complicated. I, I understand that. It's, it is... It's not absurdly complicated. but And this is where I really like... I think Angel is really good at game design. Aside from the beautiful graphics... I think that he understands some things and even though we don't really understand it, I think he really just has a knack for coming up with a different way of doing the same thing that everyone else is doing. So nanobots is also a clever idea, but he was saying, how would I make that different and not as, I don't know, cheaty, more cumbersome, but still efficient. And and then he comes up with this genuine new concept of the, of the crawler. Right, so this one is now en route over to my location here, where we make engines. Once I have the first engines going, that is the time where I'll start making, you know, I'll actually start, place that down immediately, make some of the, my, the good bots. Yeah, there are other mod makers who make things complicated for the sake of making cup being the new angels mod? And it's like, no, no, angels mod is not just complicated. It also has some genuine new and genuine, uh, interesting new concepts to it. Angels is just because it's dumb in comparison to Bob's. The majority is God given. Yeah, I felt exactly the same, but if you give it a shot and see how it was done, I actually played a game with angel where he, illustrated how it was supposed to be built and he built like massive structures really efficiently because why not uh i don't think this is clever because now i will only make these and i don't think that's a good idea i would rather want more and of course i mean i i prefer nanobots because yeah, they're nanobots. I guess I'll just pick this up and pick that up. Go, you're gonna go here. There, and this one will then be copy, paste. Blue, how many? 50? Yes, thank you. All right, so we do have some assemblers. Now we can always just come back to this location. Sam is giving Angel Bob a second chance. He never, never liked it. I, I watched his, his gameplay. Ah, uh, I, it's it's like watching fail videos on YouTube. It's just you want to, you're you're watching it to see other people's misery and agony. And that's the entertainment value. And I, I do think it's a bit unfair because he's exposing his own just very first attempts while he is a, a well-known uh, YouTube creator. It's very courageous of him to expose his lack of knowledge, to be honest. Right. Let's make the new nanobots. It's totally overkill to build it like this, but I don't mind. And here I will get nanobots mark or mark two. 
There are so many things in that playthrough that I'm just, no, no, don't do that, don't do that, that's not right, but it's it's fine, he is doing it his way and he'll, uh, he'll learn like everyone else. All right, what are we missing here? We are missing, that one is still a bit of a way off. I will just see if I can, here, I'm just gonna take the lubricant and I'm gonna force feed it in, boom. All right. Exactly. Everyone learns, and that it. But there's this is the part. Everyone learns, but it's also very difficult to be learning something that a lot of people know, right? Okay. At the bottom line, Victoria is doing in sense that you want just the right parts. Yeah, and I think it's more about more than just engineering. It's also production management. And there are a lot of lean concepts that translate directly into Factorio. There's one concept that isn't there, but I would like to be up there. And that's having a carrying cost for inventory because you can see how much I waste inventory and that's not lean. In my belts and blocks series, I am designing explicitly to not have buffers. I don't have buffers during the chain. I only have them at the very end where I'm producing. So that one, that base has no buffers. I haven't really put any, I mean, highlighted it. What's this one doing? This is not doing very well. Why do we not have any iron? Why do we not have anything? Good. Uh, a bot can carry one stack up to 200. So they can carry full stack. That's really nice. Uh, yeah, Angel is making agriculture and angel science. I'm I'm not excited about the agriculture, but I'm pretty sure that, I mean, I have faith in him in the sense that I don't get it, but he probably has a point and I'll uh, accept it. I'll give it a shot and I'll do it. For example, sheet calls is something I don't get in his mod pack. I don't just don't get it. I don't get the point of it. I don't, I think it's wasted. Um, yeah, it's strength casting as well. Don't get it either. Yeah, of course. The the oil is there's a tiny little uh, wasteful buffer there, tiny little one. But that's true. I could actually remove it. I actually had that buffer because I didn't know. Didn't uh, I built it early and I don't need it at this point because I want to make sure the production is aligned with the consumption, not anything else. That's a good point. I'm just standing here watching this. Is anything being brought in? Didn't something go this direction earlier? Oh, you are just recharging. Recharging is so painful because it takes forever for them to get there. Oh, so you're missing. Oh, they are creating that cool. I might want to get this one. I don't think I knew. I do. That's my favorite thing in the whole wide world is this one. So let's build it. Actually, one, two, three, four. Can't it be crafted in these? I think. I am still bugged how new people try and, and don't bother to at least study initial research. Yeah, but. On the other hand, there's, I think uh, Exterminator also said it, I said this made him feel like it was the first time playing, right? And and I think that's a really good point. What? Someone was flying around with some, oh, right there here. And what are we missing? We're missing some gear wheels. Anyone coming in here? Get that and put it in here. What else? Steel? All right, I'm gonna cheat my way to some steel. And I'm also going to cheat my way to some iron because I am an impatient bastard here. And there. Is someone inbound? Yeah, someone is inbound. This is up to 100. Uh, 
Oh, do you use this just about? Yeah, well, that's... Um... There we go. Look at these. Look at these amazing things we have here. Pew, pew. Look at the look at the speed. Look at them. Look at them. This is amazing. They're so awesome. Oh, look at this just zooming past from one to the next. Like, oh my god, this is so fast. I want more. Look at that. Isn't this amazing? I have nano I have fast yeah, exactly. They're so fast. I get I gotta get more. Gotta get, look at this. Everything becomes easier now. And the next part is is then I go on the crusade of picking up slow butts. Uh, I think so, but I also think it just needs to be more stable. But look at these. Look at this. Oh, where you go? Where you go? Where you go? Huh? Huh? Here? Boom. Zooming past. Raising up there. Look at that. Oh, I'm going to stand here the next two hours just picking up one at a time. What are we missing? Yeah. Okay, I need to check something. Can I make... Yes, I can. So I'm going to take these out. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's pretty stupid. You are pretty damn stupid, you bots there. You just moved everything over. And... That one. That one. There. Oh, uh, also put something in here. Cool. 1,000. Excellent. I want to use these when I can. And why is this one not producing? Ooh. That's actually really interesting. That is because of this one. You are not producing because of carbon. Yeah, that's my suspicion. And that's what we are going to work on now. Because at this point, I can just go here and pick up four more. Look at that. Zooming past. Soon I'll be starting to remove the old ones. Because I think I just need 50 or so. Then it'll be faster. All right. Uh, let's see. Hmm. So, Mammoth, do you think Lotus and Adjustable Inserters are just cheating when playing with Angels Bob? Because it's Angels who added warehousing to his mod pack, so it's native to use Lotus. And he's the one who made the graphics for the Lotus, so let's not forget that. So if he didn't want to use Lotus in his mod pack, he wouldn't have created these uh, graphics. The funny thing is, why are there wires on the Lotus when they cannot be hooked up to wires? That's just a bit of a shame. Will you show your mineral production facility? I just want to see how enormous... It, it doesn't get very big. This is very small. This is my mineral production and something is wrong because I have run out of coal. Okay. Well, that does it. Coal is a major concern. Here. Oh, thanks for highlighting it, highlighting it because that illustrates how screwed I am. There we go. And that means actually everything had ground to a halt and we were consuming our buffers. Look at the iron, how low it is. And let's see. But this is... Okay, this is good. That's actually accruing at this point. Is it because... Right, this is stopped. These are backlogged. Great, 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 great. Why is this one not working then? Guess these two are just not producing fast enough. Or it's because everything is being consumed over to this one. Are you not 1k? And how much do you have? It's, oh right, it's because it's already picking up 600. So it's already subtracting 600 from the 1500. That's true. Uh, I don't know if he... No, he didn't disable it. He just didn't build a parallel mod that does the same, same as Loader Redux. Okay, so we are back at it again. What I need to build at this point is actually more this facility. Bigger, better, faster, stronger. And I think the correct thing is actually going up and building it at my location up here, my production, my build everything factory. I also think I need to be able to go by, go past here. So once I expand this further out, I will be needing, needing to reserve it for a walking path. Right, I will be crafting 
things we need. I think I'll try to craft them here. Because I'm also going to replace my entire uh, bust here with that. Okay, so you are going to make Altifarm Mark 1. Yes. Okay, there, there. No, no, that's just not a good idea. Just not a good idea. You're probably going to make Altifarm Mark 2 then. There we go. Now it gets a bit tricky. How are we going to do this? Uh, this one. You are inserting back into that position, but you are removing the connection. Yes. Same with this one. This is removing connection, and here it's inserting back. So what I'm doing here is basically from this one, I put it back in. This one should then require everything for both of them so that this guy can be only mark two. Probably not make a thousand of this, probably make 20. That'd be funny coming back to this one and just seeing, oh, that's a thousand. All right, that's pretty good. And now I'll take this one in here. 500. Oh, stone bricks. I wonder if stone bricks are rested somewhere. And what else do you need? You need steel and more stone bricks and electronics and stone pipes. Stone pipes? Yeah, they're, they're okay. So I can't remember a single thing. Steel. Steel was one. 500 steel. And electronic circuit boards. It's another one. 200. And stone pipes? Oof. And the last one was more stone bricks. Yeah, that's a lot, actually. How much is being delivered? Everything except stone pipes. Why is stone pipes not being delivered? I'm pretty sure that was part of the network here. Nope, you're just... Ugh. Come on. That's so unprofessional. Right. I wonder how big are these on the network or on this? Ugh, too bad. I can't do this because they'll take up too much space. Good. And let's look, have a look at my favorite production facility in the world. I already have 16 of these. Whee, look at the fat, look at the speed. Now I think from now on, okay, why are you not working? Gears, are you serious? Really, gears that's uh, holding you back. Right. How much did I set? I said 100. All right. Um, at this point, any slow one without materials in, I'll pick those up. Shouldn't that be like an idea? Because I keep getting more. Look at that. That's 12 more of the good ones. So anything that is slow i don't know how many i actually have oh it would be nice because i'm gonna for the next i don't know 200 hours of gameplay i'll be keep finding one of these slow ones here and there i'm not gonna go on a crusade for this but i will i'll, I'll need to find them there oh, i can't stop looking for them can i pick it up there yes and let's get more of these Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy about this. And I'll just make a nice little junk chest for... Yeah. You can be put in there. Boom. Hogwarts. I want to keep track of how many I actually have. And before I create the first one, I should have looked and just said, how many do I have again? Which also means I need to dismantle this part. Because I actually have 50 wasted here. Ugh. And... Go away. Now I'll take it. Right. That's one. Nope, I can't pick them up on the map. I have to pick them up in real life. Now let's see if this one is working. 
This, oh, it's not working because I'm not having any stone bricks. One more. Really? One more? What are we missing? That one? 13 gear wheels. That's so pathetic. I'm I'm gonna go the good old handcrafting way. Boom. 250. Honestly, this is look at the speed that is being delivered with. And I know that Angel after he created them, because I kind of pushed him into doing this. Uh he said Yeah, they were maybe a bit too fast for his liking. I can understand that, but but they're so nice, they're so cute. I like them. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's see. Sorry. I was, um... There is a mod for bot replacement. Really? Oh, yeah, that's true. There is. I saw that in one of uh, Angel's... No, uh, a Roomba. Good old Roomba. I wonder... Anyone know if, if he, he has stated something on his Discord, whether he has chosen not to play uh, Victoria or it's just because he's been sick and traveling or if he's just uh, lost interest or if it's because of the, the drama. Because I've just noticed that both uh, Stijo and Arumba and Gepwin for that matter stopped playing around the same time. And I know from Gepwin what the issue was, but not from the other guys. I don't think they've said anything Ten more. Yeah, these ten are good. Uh, they're much faster. Okay. Uh, streaming playing. Yeah. He did have some good things. Uh, that's for sure. Right, what am I looking for? Oh, hold on. I need to run over here just to make these two into proper box. It's too close. I don't like it having this list close. Well, I guess I'll just do this one. What is... Okay, it's only when it's above five... No! Okay, this is 1,000. But why is it not putting it back? Ah, right. But this one should be linked to the global network. Network... Only when it's less than 2,000. Let's do that. And now we can open. And this one will also be linked to the network. You will have a ground less than 200, I guess. Go, go. How much do we have? Oh, not quite 200. Maybe it should only have 100, but whatever. 100, yeah. <sighs> Sorry. Let's go with the intuition here, 200. That's uh, just once that has to be crafted. This one will then also be linked here. Stone pipes less than 200. Good. So this is now working and I will be seeing things being picked up. Yes. Great. He did a stream on C blog recently. Other than that, he said he's sick and stuff in Europe. Okay, cool. So he hasn't given up on it. It's just a lack of time and health and things. You know, these two go away. I don't want you. You, I can't pick you up yet. Oh, look at that. Instead, a speedy one comes in. Just keep him in a visual eye out for things and let's see if I have some more robots I think I'll actually mark the robots here you can see how beta it is it doesn't even have a name yet nine more yay I don't know why I place them there that's good and they require oh I have 28 here that's nice right this one is not producing anything. Why are you not producing anything? What are you missing? What are you missing? You're missing stone bricks and iron. Why is iron keep being a problem? I have 600 iron coming in. I have 500 stone bricks coming in. All right, everything is coming in. 
all the stuff that isn't there already is coming in. And it's just really slow. Good. That's okay. In the meantime, I can start figuring out what else I want. Convince Angel to do both three mark three bots and I will use them. I don't want him to do mark three bots. I think they're really good the way they are, and anything faster than that would be rather imbalanced. Oh look at that, all my good ones are idling. That's not good. I don't want my good ones idling when they're there work, there's work to be done. You pick up. And all of these slow ones, look at that, how slow they are. And then one of them comes zooming by. But it is fun. They have a huge capacity for transferring bulk items, but they're not very fast. So again, this goes back to the lean principles here. That they are not efficient from that perspective. All right, so the other thing I wanted to make was actually... Oh, that actually has to be up here because that's that's one of those. Uh, where is it? Here. Liquifiers. We're going to make liquifiers. Mark one, mark two. This is a machine two. It's two. Oh, how can. No, no, no. Oh, I'm a moron. This is a one. This is one. Oh, really? Yeah, the colors don't match. I also need to craft this. This is more iron. Iron is really in high demand right now. Do I even have enough iron? How is the iron doing? Not well, 3,000. Why is the iron not coming in? All right, it is. It is. It's just not getting a lot. And also the steel. How's the steel doing? Steel is doing much better. Okay, I'm going to unfortunately have to replicate this one. Okay, I just don't have anything at this point. There, take 50 of these. Thank you very much. Copy, paste. Copy, paste. Blows up. Copy, paste. Nope. Copy, paste. And of course, these need to be faster because they are actually going to be a bottleneck otherwise. Copy, paste. 200. 200 and 200 that'll it'll stabilize eventually and you're just going down here or are you going to be building the next one i don't think i'm ready to scale it up yet no that's always what i say and then i never do it i do it this way here this the reason why I wanted to change it was so that so that it would be consistent moving forward. So it'd be one, mark one, two, three. And unfortunately that just messed up a lot of other things. Here, 200. Oh, well, that's totally irrelevant because I don't have those things. Oh, come on. Stop being so silly. You're going to have to be stuck with Mark 1 electronic assembly machines for now. What? There. Yes. Would you like if Factorio devs did a gas implementation in Factorio with pressure and stuff? Mm. Gas implementation in Factorio with pressure and stuff? Not particularly. I don't think it... I think it's something that belongs in a mod. It's too complicated for the average user. Um, and it's something that it would be quite fun for someone like me, but I don't want to force it upon everyone else. But that's basically Angel's mods we we're talking about here. Uh, 
I don't know. I mean, this one will be making liquefiers. And this one will be making better liquefiers. Mark 2, Mark 3. Oh, I already can do Mark 3s. Um, technically, yes, I can, but not realistically. And inserters, running out of inserters. How embarrassing is that? I'll just grab all of them. Really? Why is my inventory so full of junk? Ah. Ah. I am getting some. Copy, paste, 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 paste. That's the liquefier mark two, mark two liquefiers. I can't see them. Oh, they're up here. No, they're not. Liquefier. Oh, they're here. Liquefier mark two. And I can be able to make Mark 3s and Mark 4s, but no more than Mark 4. All right, copy, paste. You are going to get this. I wish I could just easily scale this up. I like the new uh, addition they've implemented or are implementing. So anyone else who listens to these or watches reads, yeah, reads, that's what it's called, um, the Friday facts, and considering that how irrelevant a lot of the things are, how small the things are, and take that as a sign that we're probably not that far away. Oh, steel pipes. I don't have steel pipes, and I don't certainly do not have clay bricks. I do have a bit of clay bricks somewhere. I crafted it and put it into some random box somewhere. Where did I do about, what did I do about my clay bricks? I was sure I had it, and I thought I'd put it down here somewhere. L? I don't think I have clay bricks. No. Ah, oh, this is horrible. I build it. It's really cumbersome to build. And oh, there. Ah. Awesome. Bit of clay bricks. That's all the clay bricks I have. So treat it kindly. Yeah, you're gonna have half of it. What am I missing? We're missing the steel pipes. Good. Okay, the Yuoki mods are compatible with Angels Refining and mods. Yes, I am aware of that. Sorry for this 0.16 room that keeps machines running for 30 seconds instead of 10 crafts. What? What does that keep running for 30 seconds instead of 10 crafts? What do you mean? Uh, it definitely feels like they're getting close to the next major patch. Yes, the Omega. That's exactly my point. They're talking about some really uh, irrelevant things. What's inbound? Everything is inbound, so that's fine. And this one. What are we missing here? Steel pipes. All right, let's go get steel pipes somewhere. There are not six tiers of this for sure. One, two, three. There are only three tiers? Okay. Okay. Just robots as my normal angels bob run and having a feature will be the quality of life. Well, a liquid rework is indeed needed because seeing that Angel can't do anything about liquid metals flowing in metal pipes. Huh. Uh. Right, yeah, okay. So that part, when you copy-paste recipes, it will copy for 10 craft. Or not for 10 craft, but for more crafts. I feel this one could be repurposed. To being steel pipes as well. I think that would be reasonable. And then I also add some steel. Steel, yep. 
500. And that means you're going to take it in here. This one will be steel pipes instead. Steel pipes. This one will also be steel pipes. Steel pipes. Cool. And I'm going to kickstart it. These are slow bots. Go in there. Any slow bots not working? Yep. A few. A few to be picked up here and there. Oh, I'm on a row here. Just picking them up left and right. Anyone else? Anyone else? Nope. Oh, 40. Meow. Love it. Look at the speed. How many robots do we have? We have 190. So we still have a bit more than we used to have. There. That's a slow one. That's a slow one. At some point I'll be start picking up the slow ones even when they have stuff loaded because it's just so much faster. What about here? They're all the fast ones. What about here? No one's waiting. Oh, you're a fast one. Uh, look at how the difference in speed. That's crazy. Crazy. Crazy, I tell you. That one. Pick it up. Anyone else? Anyone? This is like hunting grass fish. I want these ones in action and the other ones out of action. Oh, you're slow. What are you doing? You look suspiciously like you're dead. That is probably because I do not have enough or if any logistics bots. Let's take it here. Um, just praying for multi-thread. At some point, my base inevitably goes down because of UPS. Yes, that's true. It's also something I wish. And I keep hearing people say, oh, but it's really difficult. I know everything in Factorio is difficult to build, but they managed to do it anyway. So I'm not the one who has to solve it, but I'm just the one who says, you really should solve it. Now they're all moving because they get stuck if there's nowhere to unload up. Oh. There's one. Yummy. Yummy. I wonder how many of the slow ones are still left. Like a lot, I would guess. 24 cargo bots. What about you? Eight and more. Pretty good. Pretty good. All right. Let's, um, let's actually see if things are working here. Look at that. We have four. Nice. What are you doing? You are missing a lot of bricks. And we have some stone, some steel pipes. Steel pipes should be able to go up here. Oops, up here. This one is being crafted. Oh, look, it does have everything. No, it doesn't have everything. I can't pick you up on the map view. What else do we need? Um, I'm just looking at this part here. I think this looks fine. Slow butt. Slow butt. And there's a slow butt. And another slow butt here. Slow butt. Oops. I picked up something. I don't know what I picked up, but something. Oh, right. The chest of junk. Maybe that wasn't a picture of slow butt. It was just a chest of slow butts. There's still a lot of slow butts in circulation. I did think, I think I had 160 of those. So it does take a while for the, me to get rid of all of them. But I'm starting to see fewer and fewer. Ah. One. This is a massive cleanup work, but it's uh, definitely very rewarding to see the fast robots uh, running around. It's also quite obvious how, how much slower they are. But remember, the alternatives is no robots. And I think compared to no robots, they are quite fast. What are you, what's your hold up? Your hold up is gears. Are you serious? Then you can have my 300 gears. Ha, awesome. All right, you can you. I think you can use filter to, to pull out MK1 bots and put, yes, but only when they're in the network, in the network, That's that totally works. Did you know that Kulai Teen, he recently started Angel Bob on, only when he is a cool guy to games and units. I, I know of him. I don't know him, obviously. It's a very known 
known guy and I've heard fun things about his let's play. Uh, also rather excruciating. It's fun to uh, to see, I'm going to call new players, uh, take on the challenges of Angels and Bob's mod. Because from my perspective, I think I've been playing about a thousand hours in this mod. So there is that. Right, now I can't be bothered to hang around here just stroking my bots here. <clears throat> Did I say that? I will need to take... Oh, why is it not working? What are you waiting for? Stone pipes? Seriously? Stone pipes? Get on with it. It's a bit hard to watch Quill after watching this seminar. It's kind of like, well, it's a very different experience. They may be more entertaining. Why are you not working? Look at this. There's some problem here. This one is stuck. Because only work when it's stone pipe less than 200. What is in my network? Stone? How the hell does that work? Oh, it's not actually in the network. Ha! Huh. That's the big catch. That does work. There we go. Finally. All right. It's always good to have new blood. Change your mind without prior knowledge. It will come with new ideas because of a fresh point of view. Yeah, sometimes. I, I, Generally speaking, of course, there's new ideas coming along, but I think there's more that people take their play style. And, and some people have play styles. For example, what I learned a lot from it was actually a Roomba doing Angels mods because he has this, this thing about, I mean, something like uh, this. That's very Arumbusk. That's a word. And I like it. Also, like this one, just taking things in and out, using these massive storage as just buffers. Ah, yeah, it's stopped. You're absolutely right. It's the damn stupid coal here. Oops, I have four coal. Where's all my coal? Because I use all the coal and that one is not working. Why are you not working? Strange. Oh, right. It's only taking when it's more than 200. Well, it's not more than 200. That's the reason why I need to focus on the coal. And I guess it's also because this one is still requesting a lot. Because I want my robots. All right. Let's, um, let's start working on this. I can't be bothered to bring more. And up here, I'll take whatever, whatever I have as a nothing. What's the problem with this one? You're not getting liquefy mark one. Oops, why mark liquefy mark one not working? It is. Oh no, it's a red. Hello. Now it's working. Good. And okay, I did the warehouse thing all on my own. I'm... Yeah, I'm, I'm not saying this. Uh, th there are many ways to reach the same conclusion, but it was uh, he had some really nice designs, and and the way that Roomba generally works is that he spends a lot of time just tuning something until it looks nice for him. And I like that. It it uh, it's it's really nice. All right, now I think I have what I need in order to start building. I need some steel, and I can't get any further until I get more. Uh, iron is dead. Iron is one hundred iron left. No. I need to stop my coal demand. Where everywhere accepts that. Okay, so where do I request coal? This one has stopped and I'm not requesting plastic. This one, not requesting anything. I'm going to stop you from requesting coal. At least that's something. How much is inbound? Two is inbound. That's not much. And if I now look at this, because this loop should be providing a surplus. So if it isn't, why isn't it? It's fine, that one's... It is, of course, taking some out. 
Oh, look at that. Look how much I, I just don't use. That is inconvenient to say the least. That's a liquefier. Should I just upgrade everything here to liquefy Mark II? Because now it's not really a problem. There, that's liquefies Mark II. I can take more of them up here. Go, 17. What are how many? More liquefies Mark II. And uh, not that one in the middle. Not really necessary. Why are you complaining? Oh, look at that. It's simply just, no, it's not. It, it is, everything is working. Why are you not able to keep up? You're, you're working fine, but you're not able to get in there. So that means these eyes also have to be upgraded. Now that's the least of my concern. That should be pretty damn easy to do. Question is whether I should make the same or I should make a better design afterwards because I do like the fact that I don't need need this one this should now generate significantly more and now I'll get something here yeah faster algae usage yes indeed just see if just want to see if how much it, it actually is that one that one Much nicer, much nicer. I like Arumba's playstyle, but sometimes he goes insane. And also, he was the guy who started to ignore Metalgen because of him. I found you. Oh, really? Oh, that's not long ago. Um. So you should say I don't like him because if it hadn't been for his playstyle, you wouldn't have found me. I don't know. All right, let's have a look because I think there's a problem with this one. I should disconnect these. I don't need any crushed at all because coke is something I can easily create myself. So here I'll take coke in. What? This is coke. Coke will easily be replaced. And there. Yeah. So. And that will be requested chest. Yeah, why can I not pick it up? There's so much crap in my inventory. I don't need the fish in my inventory. I don't need those small Nixie tubes. Who is putting all this crap in my inventory? And one solar panel. Yay, one solar panel. Just stuff, man. Just stuff. There. Where do we have a request I can copy? There. Boom. How does that work out? Go. And what I need to request is actually that one. And the reason why I want to request it is because instead of using coal at this point, coal to make coke to make, no, coal to make crushed coal to make coke, it's much better to use all of this stupid amount of coke that I have produced up here, that I produce from coal as a side product. Much better to use that. I will severely cut down on my demand. And this one is not needed either. Because now I have this one, this will be fine. So I need some carbon. Carbon is fine, and I need some coke. Good, and probably should use this one. Copy, paste, and up here. We take this one out. This one is going to be 1,000. This one is going to be 1,000 of those. Yes, let's take that one. 
All right, so that's much cleaner. Much cleaner indeed. And now I don't really have a lot of... What? Why are you using that for fuel? That should not be... Um... Really? Okay, I'm just gonna try something here. Again, this is all about cutting down on the actual coal usage. Hey, you're slow. Go away. You're not allowed to come in here. What? It's purring at me or... Alright, so this, I think I fixed that now. Hello, slow one. We're gonna pick you up. And you're also slow one. Pick you up. Let's also get a little light over here. Light in the darkness. I, I think that's pretty good. You are coming down here. Cool. All right. So next up is keeping an eye out. If you see any, what? Get more dioxide for the little that I use. Hello, Captain Caps. Captain Caps Lock. Right. This one is probably running out soon, but it actually is doing fine and also stable. Now let's move over here. What are we going to build? If we think about it, I'm going to build some algae farms. How are we going to do this the best way? Let's start with my default setup. Just so we know out of reference what I could, what it could look like. And hello math. Now we need to figure out what, whether I can do math or not. Okay, I'm going to remove some things here. I'm going to remove small power poles. And I'm going to move the yellow inserters. Good. Now, what are we missing? We're missing dome pipes, dome pipes. Ooh, that's not a lot. Why is that not a lot? Okay, because this one is only enabled when this is more than 500. Damn. Uh, no, that's kind of not what I wanted. Yay, we're in the car. And jump out of the car. And by the way, now that I have to remember it, this one, if you haven't already, then check out all of the other presents I have somewhere else. And by all means, if, uh, if you feel like it, you are welcome to come up with good suggestions on, for a new series or for a coming series, you can say. Something that you feel would be fun for me to sink my teeth into. That one goes here, copy paste. These two next to each other and Arbo, copy paste. Yep, and except that's not working because it's actually technically outside the network. So we'll put it here. Oh, power, who's powering you? Oh, that one, okay. Cool, so this is fine, except for the fact that there is no power, no fuel here. How do we get the fuel in? Ugh, I don't know. Maybe get some yellow ones. Here. There, that should spam that enough. All right, and what I need now is some good old Coke pellets going here. Boom. Coke pellets, and you're also running on Coke pellets. Nice. And then I'll be taking it from here if needed. Let me just check if it is actually working. It is. Yep, perfect. 
So it'll just stay here. And, oh, hello, you're slow. You're not allowed to come here. What else? Do an Angel Bob series, but also add Yoki. No, no, it, Bob's and Yoki, they need to stay separate. They do not work well together. They, they make no sense together, to, to be honest, and not in my opinion. Right, so this one is not working because it needs to be 500. That's distinctly not 500 yet, and me scaling up here is not really cutting it. And every time something comes in, these guys, the fast robots, are rushing in to steal it. So I definitely need more stone bricks. But it's kind of sad because this it's not really possible. These ones... Yeah, it doesn't matter because then I just put it in here and then the rest goes in here. This is a, a priority split out that basically says go in here until it's full. And if so full, then you can start heading in that direction. And yeah, the problem is definitely the fact that I do not produce enough. It's also only one of these. So this one just cannot keep both of these alive. Oh, right, 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 right. I... Well, the least we can do is put that one in. That'll be somewhat faster. Good. Looks like it's actually feeding them. Keeping them fed. Cool. That's good. Uh, anything else? Alright. <sighs> There's a mod that... that what does what? Yeah, Mammoth, there is, it's called only smelting or something like that. And Mammoth, I think you're right about Yuoki being a late game mod. But I just find it, it's so, it has a lot of, it is, it is an alpha. It is an alpha. Nothing more, nothing less. It's an alpha. And, and it's been an alpha for two years or so, or at least a year. And I don't think that's fair to, to keep playing it then. It, it really needs to mature and polish a lot more. Now, back to this one. Is this a good setup? I think it uses a hell of a lot of machines, but we are seeing that it actually fits quite well. Let's take a look at this one. This is point 1.5. All right, hold tight. We're going to do math. Not looking at inbound, only looking at outbound. Mineralized water. No. 20, 40... Algae 20 seconds. That's two algae every second times one and a half. Three algae every second. Great. I'm putting three algae in every second. And this is speed 2.25. That's way overdone. I'm putting three per second. So this is actually strange, isn't it? If I look at it, because it shouldn't need to be this fast. It really shouldn't. This should be more than enough, a liquefier mark one. This one is taking, if I get three per second, it is consuming more than three per second. 10 per three seconds, that's more than that three and a third per second. And it's even speed one and a half, just with the normal one. So I think it might be an, an inserter issue or it might actually hmm. um, Mammoth, I know what you mean but and I guess I also know who you are referring to recently who that new player who built stone furnace arrays Isn't a simpler crafting? It might be, or it might just be. Um, but I'm also thinking if I, if this one fits with a Mark One, then I'd much rather just have. Actually, if I look at it, then this one should be able to service both of them. If the inserters are fast enough, of course. Because this one is taking three per second. Now this needs more than th three and a third per second, but it does also speed 
2.25, so this should definitely be able to keep up. However, it might be an issue of insertos, and in that case, we'll fix that this way. There. Or you know what? Why don't I just fix it the correct way? Look at that. I can just make stack insertos like it's nobody's business because I have uh, I have a lot of <laughs> a lot of gears. There we go. We're gonna do stack insertos. Cool. There we go. So now the next part is this one is operating and then we have to make sure that it's not operating. It's not actually operating at peak capacity, but if it was working at peak capacity, it would output five every three seconds. That is an impossible math. It cannot be done. It's complete. We need the quantum topology guide to help explain how you divide five by three. So let's make it even more complicated and multiply it by 2.25, right? So this is the sound of me thinking. No, definitely not the sound of me bringing up a calculator. We have 11.25. I thank you. Uh, and then we divide by three seconds. So this should be outputting 3.75 per second when you considering. Ah, I don't want to use Helmut. It's it's um yeah, it's four ish. The funny thing is, I saw three point seven five, and the first thing I thought of was that's the price of a stamp in Denmark. Because when I was a kid, a stamp, postage stamp was three seventy five, and now it's twenty two kroners. So that's a hell of an inflation from I was a young kid, and I'm not that old. Right, so we are putting outputting 3.75 and let's have a look at this one. If you are getting, <laughs> it's not a price of a stamp anymore, that's for sure. And right, so this one, if this was speed one, let's always start with speed one, then we can always calculate it afterwards. This is consuming three per second. Three per second, yes. And then if, I need more than three per second. What if it was speed 3.75? That would be nice, wouldn't it? That means this should actually be a perfect ratio. Pretty much perfect ratio. And this is producing 3.75 per second. That is too much for a fast inserter. That means I need that one. Yeah, this is okay. And I really want direct insertion. For me, direct insertion is very important here. Can I can I make it? I can make this cooler, I think. Like this. And then we go underneath. They don't connect it anymore. Yeah, I like this. And then let's see if I'm calculating. Hey, yeah, postal service. Yeah, it's pretty damn insane. The funny thing is, funny, tragic thing is that I had, what was I getting? I was getting some yeah, I was getting a cross trainer. That's 60 kilos of metal being transported. So 60 kilos of metal, and I needed to bring it from one end of Denmark to the other end of Denmark. So I saw the cheapest option was actually the Danish Postal Service. Great, the Danish Postal Service cost, what was it, 29 kroners. And, and yes, that was just calculated into euros and stuff. That's about four euros. But a postage stamp is euros the difference between less than 100 grams of paper and a 60 kilo cross trainer was one euro in freight and it got there within three days i mean one thing you could say is that's amazing service on the other hand you say maybe the letters are a bit overpriced just a bit I had to send a thin book 40k army codex so 
yeah, you just like, all right, I'm gonna, if we had Uber still, which also sucks, then it would be easier just to say, well, I'm just gonna Uber it to you. Oh, look at that. That's actually pretty cool because this one is exactly hitting this one as well. Nice. This is actually turning out to be a great design, at least in my book. Can it, what? Can this one reach all the way over? Oh, it can. Then we're gonna change it. I want it more compressed. Because compression is fun. Ah, uh, then I'm actually gonna need more, whatever. I think this is better. Go, copy, paste. Go, copy, paste. And that just means I need to take all of this. Go away. I didn't kill any grass fish. No, I did not. No grass fish were harmed during the making of this factory. <clears throat> not entirely true. See, it's getting closer. And then I just hope that it works. Uh, I'm unfortunately at this point need to make differences here. Now I need way more, but that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter, that's fine. Actually. I think I'll do it this way because then it's much easier to jump over to the next one. Always power pose, the last thing you do. Anything, anyone who can see some latent flaws in this, how far can we get over? From here to here, from here to here. Now there might actually be a different option. How far does that go? That only, oh, it doesn't exactly doesn't reach the inner ones. Whatever, it's gonna be four no matter what. I like this one. I just saw that it'll let you make tin copper wire directly from molten copper and tin. I need to change my pants now. Oh, that's, that's, that's um, nice. <clears throat> Or something. Right, so this is the easy part. Now we need to create the same. Also insert here. Hmm. I'm really a bit at a loss on how to approach this. There, got it. I need one of these. And that needs to go maybe at this corner or maybe at that corner. I think I need to put it in this corner as well. And let's make some more medium power poles and I'll just put it in this corner there. Right, so that's still powered, right? What, what else do we have? We have up here, I think I really like this one. This one is kind of a good way of doing it, I guess. I'm in the middle of rebuilding my ore production for the third time, <laughs> now including crystals and geo processing. Wow, that's, that's pretty cool. Uh, I do have red belts, but I don't want to make. I don't want to make red belts unless I need it, and I don't. I don't need red belts. But this one is a. I think this is a good module. So let's not break it then. I'll put you here, and then I of course need to hook you up to the rest of the RoboPort network. Now that's medium, small ones, and that's the small one. No, nope, I don't need that many of them. Oh, 
Why is that just a problem all the time? Yep, like this. And this one, because now it can actually connect. It worked out. I keep wanting them to do that automatically. Yep, as you can see, keep wanting to have them do that automatically. And we need some power bolts as well. Good. All right, let's build let's build how we get this in. So I need to consider how much. Uh, what do you do with geodes? Nothing. Throw them away. Sink them into the ocean. I hate geodes. No, I don't, but I hate him. Yes, I do. I do, actually. Um, no joke. All right, so let's see how much. This is using 100 mineralized water per 20 seconds. That means it used 150 per 20 seconds. That means it uses... Seven and a half per second. Ugh, disgusting numbers. Let's see, how fast can we produce mineralized water? Producing mineralized water, I can create 100 per second. That is completely overscaling any and all of this if I can only just shove enough crystallized water in. So this is easy to do. Gonna be easy there and easy here. You know what? I'll actually make it slightly different. Here. I just now, now the reason for me to building it separately is because then I can experiment once I have figured out the best way of doing it. I can place it all the correct place. Good. So that is this one. Now I need to make sure that in how fast can I get the crushed in? Let's let, look at our best crusher we can have available. This one is the best crusher. I do not make this one because I don't have brass. Yeah, it's close, but don't have progress. All right. And uh, let's uh, see lots of comments here. Diamonds are only one crushing the rest gave me the straight gems I needed without silly slurry. Yeah, I am. Um, I create. I take this in my marathon automation. I created all I needed uh, from direct crushing the geodes like these. I produced just these until I could, and then I don't think I did it. I don't, maybe I just made the rest into a crystal slurry. I think I did. Whatever was excess, I made it into crystal slurry. So you're making it speed two. So why don't we just ignore the fact that you're speed 2.2, 2.25 and you're speed two. How much crushed oil can you make? You can make two per second and you are gonna consume 10 per second. It's obviously not enough. And this is not enough either. That's is just totally not enough. I mean, this one and one more would then we'd be starting to get there. What is it? Ore crusher? Simply, simply just old fashioned stone. Uh, here. There, thirty. One, two, three. Still need more. 34, one more, and then it's the stone bricks. Cool. I think that's going to be enough. Copy paste this one. Come on, I want it. I'm going to start on float refining, just trying to decide what way I want to do things I want. So you need even less 
go. Ah, right. Okay. Yeah. That's if you put productivity modules in, but I don't, I was actually surprised at how few things that Angel has made that can take productivity modules. He does not like productivity modules that I have noticed. Okay. So what if I do this? This is all fine and good, except that it doesn't work, right? Because where am I getting my belt? It needs to go by here. Um, Could actually just go straight through. X. I must have pressed the X button. There we go. And I guess we can. Yeah, not quite. We'll uh, take red belts then. Nothing else, just for the opportunity to get a red underground belt going. That's there. Pick up, delivery, copy, paste. That one shoves it in there, this one shoves it in there. And then I'll grab it from here, 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 here. This one. I like building these things where you don't really know if it's going to work, but you just build the whole damn thing and just cross your fingers. Ah, that's another disgusting thing. I need a separate one out here. Oh, I don't like that. Don't like that at all. Yeah, this is fine. I think I'm going to change it as well so it goes up upwards. All right. And that's my underground. Go from here to here. Yes. That's one. Unfortunately, it's going to have to be repeated over here, which makes it a bit more difficult. Ah, oh, it's a lot of activity in chat. I see that I must make some silly mistake that everyone's yelling at. Let me just build this one and take a look. All right. Find a recommendation. Float all ores equally. Spamming enough pure water is easy and void all the waste water. Float all ores. Uh, I think I actually... In, in, in all modesty, in my marathon automation, I think I've found the best solution I have seen yet on this topic. There. <laughs> it's basically, this is not good, is it? It, it doesn't seem right to be doing over slicing it. What I did in my marathon automation series was basically build it so it could really fast do every single one and then only used the pure process. It does mean that you don't get any slack. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Where are the sorting? So if you look at the sorting recipe here, for example, right? So you can do, I did all of these, only did these. It's so easy to balance. It's just everything was scaled up towards this. So that's um that worked really well. Um should this work? Yes, it should definitely work. But where am I where where's this one? Someone has to deal with that as well. All right, let's have a calculation about the Carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide is also 100. That's also 150 per 20 seconds. So that's seven and a half per second for each. And this one can produce carbon dioxide at what rate? 70. 70. Are you serious? I cannot calculate like that. 
I'll just build two. And then just know that it's enough. There. And you are going to request... Somehow you need to get this one in. Or, or even better, even better. You're going to request it in a network, in a box. Oh no, the symmetry is broken. There, and I will take that one. Good, that's 200, 500, 200. We have fast bots. That one's good. Um, you know what? Why am I not just doing exactly the same here? I don't even want it on the belt. Oh my god. Oh, the horror. What if it was possible to just request it like this? Yeah. Not going to be completely easy. You're going to be out here. That one is going to be down there. Got it. This one. Now the next question is, can I then put it back into this one fast enough? I don't know if I can. Here. Two in. Got it. Another one here. Two in. And these are easy. I don't particularly like this one. And yep, I think I actually want these to be stack inserters. Stack inserters, yeah, okay. Uh, at that point, why not request crush stone? No, crush stone is not, I don't want to request crush stone because it basically has lower compression. There I go with the compression. But I hate the fact that it doesn't fit. You can feel it on me, right? You can feel how much it's just, it's really bugging me. That is not working uh, correctly. That one. Doesn't list a mineral catalyst at all. Control E, control E. This is, I'm, I'm contemplating just having two of these just to make it symmetrical. There's also the option of getting something out here. I gotta be careful about that. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to do. It doesn't, doesn't feel right to me. This way I can at least do three, right? Okay. That's three and it's definitely not enough, but it's better than nothing, I guess. That one's okay, that one's okay. Could I switch the whole thing one over? No, I could not. Copy, paste. Copy, paste. Yes. That's a lot less. My LG to C ratio is neat and somewhat tidy. Everything else is all over the place. <laughs> Uh, 
that's too bad you don't have any power problems. Those were more fun. Well, actually, let's have a look at the power issue, how it's doing. It's completely rock steady at 149. Yeah, I'm sorry if this is not your cup of tea. It's, um, it's a necessity. I like this one. I like it, even though it's only three. No, I don't like it. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is just horrible. I, I just can't do it right. I want four of them. I just... Too many. Is there another option? There might be another option. There might be another option. It's fun and silly. Could it be... There's another option. I Usually when I spend too much time on one design, I end up actually being very proud of what I do. See, now the next option is, can I just throw it in with loaders and then just have this one do everything? I think I can. Because I could do like one, two, one, two. So that's surfing these two. All right? Loader, loader. Easy peasy. Loader, loader. Right? Ah, gotcha. I think I like this. It's expensive because I use a million loaders, but it's still pretty good. And I bet I don't have any iron. Nope, not a single teeny tiny bit of iron anywhere. That's disgraceful. Uh, can you please just get something for me? I'm going to grab that one just to keep the ball rolling. Get more. I feel the same when you spend too much time on a design gift. Yeah. And and I also feel that it's rare that I don't end up with something I like. For example, this one I actually really like. Yeah, this this is this is nice. I mean, yes, it takes some out of space. I might just de might not need this. I could just do it this way. Look, now we're starting to optimize it and it gets better all the time. Boom, boom. Nope. Boom. That's, that doesn't take up much space. And it, I mean, compared to this one, it actually takes up less space. Good. And it doesn't use anything. Thank God for loaders. What would we do without loaders? Good thing I didn't decide to not use loaders for whatever political, ethical reasons that some people do have for not using loaders. I do not understand that. Don't require anything else? No. All right, this is good. This is very good. You can you can feel it on me that I'm, I'm getting energy now. Ah, it's a bit crowded with these. I'm off for two way to freaking early this morning. <laughs> okay. Well, thanks for dropping by. It was uh, nice to see another Dane around here. It's not rest for the brain. No, I know that. This one is awesome. I like it. I like it. I'm happy. Smash it in there. Good. Oof. And then there's something really elementary I have forgot to think about. So this one is, does not need to be there. This can actually move a lot closer. Because why wouldn't it make, move closer when it can? So why don't we just move as close as we can, like that. Again, this is good. 
This one is slack in vast quantities. Copy, paste. Loaders are made to fill a belt. Uh, the problem with loaders is you may overload the loader crusher with 200 slack. I don't care. It's a one-time thing. It's a one-time deal. So that's, that's just the way it is. So how do we like this? Anyone see some problems with it that I don't see? I, I like it. I think this makes perfect sense. Now the next question is just, since this one has to be by the water, should I make it here or should I make it out there? Or should I make, oh, I should make it up here. Of course I should. Of course, of course. Oof, then I don't lose it. All right, and this one, now let's take that thing. How close to the edge do I want to make it? I think I actually want to make it close to the edge. It's still not very close. I mean, that's pretty close, I think. There. And let's make some offshore pumps. And offshore pumps is the most impossible thing to find in your inventory. You know it's there, but you're not going to find it. Let's take all of this out. No landfish were harmed. Good. All right. <clears throat> I'm, um, I'm, I'm quite happy with this. Now let's just see if it works. And then I take my blueprint from over here and I tag it on. Interesting. So this one will enable me to send them this direction. I guess that goes over to the other area because I haven't made any room for it. It's not entirely hooked up yet like that. And I'll just take another one here and maybe a third one. I think I can support three. That requires a bit of expansion down here. Let's do that. I'll just do this one expansion of where we need it. We can always, oh, typical. And the last one, boom. Let's see how much we get, we get down here and what we can do about it. What else? A couple of these. A lot of stack inserters. How the hell do we make stack inserters? They are expensive to make. Take a hell of a long time to make. And they require iron. And iron is something I just do not have for some reason. There. One. Basically trunk boards. They're still here. And what else? What else? Okay, let's have a look at this one because I'm not producing enough iron. In the two iron deposits, these two, they are... Oh, that one. And that one. They are producing all the time. Right? Yeah, they are. So that's about as fast as it can go with this puny little thing. Many, many more. Looks good. And also in here, I think, I think it's cheaper to do it with the full belts instead of with the undergrounds, at least for now. So you have water. That's the one thing that is already there. This one, 
but you are not part of the logistics network up here. So if I hook you up to the network, I guess it will work, right? Where's the easiest up there? sneaking my way through here and there and now comes the strange and silly part that is they don't actually need power but i'm still going to give you power because other than i can't stand watching this blink all the time it's now one network right and this is one network and you are getting something in here you are getting something in here great 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 right might need to get more slack production. Yes, absolutely. But one thing at a time. One thing at a time. Oh, look at the waste. Good. Here. Oh, there's something about power as well. They can't jump all the way over, so we're going to have to get power from the side as well, from the side. Good. How is that not working? There. Good. Everyone's, everything is working, except I've for completely forgotten to put any lights on this. But I guess that's something we can... We can add at a later stage like this here, 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 here. Great. Let's see if it works. What do you mean? One thing at a time. You're on playing Victoria. Well, I am, but I can, I've also had a comment on YouTube saying that they thought that, and I, it's, it's fair enough that I make too many mistakes in my saying, I call blue circuits, blue science, the other way around, all of that. I know that. I'm a man, I cannot multitask. And at this point, I have to play the game, follow chat, and talk. That's three things. So I can do three things really badly, or one thing quite well. Let's put it like that. So at this point, I am definitely doing three things poorly. What's also interesting is that I have not even tested this. I love this part where you hook up something and you've not even tested if it works. That is fun. And there's something really elementary like ah, like that one, for example, that isn't hooked up. One thing decently or three things badly. Those are my options or your options if you like. See. This is the problem. It will completely jam them in there, but at least, I mean, it's operating. It's not operating at peak performance, but it is operating. Let's have a look at this one. Okay, these are about to come out. They will fill up here very fast. Look at that. And these are filling up as well. They are slightly overscaled, but that's fine. That's actually really, I like these ratios. Like, look at this, how fast it actually goes down. But there are two of them. So this one, there, now it's down. That's when it's halfway done. It's when it's 60% yeah, done. This is good. And there's one problem. And that's everything is inserting on one side. So I will need to take that one and copy. Paste. And paste yes and for the time being i will just put this come on place it What?
And I do not have enough of these. Good. And then we'll... So the point is now I will just make... One work. And it is not hooked up. Why is it not hooked up? That one's hooked up. All right. Good. All right, so this is now producing and it will just gradually, some robots will come in, bring it up here so that this one, I think I'll take it to 500 just because. Excellent. Anything being up? Yep, 200 are being picked up. And then basically I want this one just copied multiple times. And then how many times I can do until I have full red yellow belts. And then over here, I need to figure out what am I going to do with all this? I think I'll build like a proper uh, cold processing facility. Uh, the reason why I'm crossing the road is because I'm signaling to myself that the next thing I want to do is build something over here. Oh, that's not good. Why are you taking that one? You should be taking this guy and putting it. This one is not working, that's fine. This one is, oh, I'm missing some rather crucial points of this blueprint. We should also make some better inserters. This will give us high capacity for making, uh, for making coal much better. And then next we'll be looking at getting more. There we go. Now it's working, that was stuck at 200. It looks like it's not really going to be a problem for these ones to keep up with the exception of the fact that I don't have enough. That's going to be, I, I don't need to scale this up at this point. I know quite well what the problem will be. The problem is quite clearly the fact that I do not have enough slack to support this. That's okay. That's okay. Then I just need to up my slack production, but I will do that by having one more of these. What is that? That's an electrolyzer Mark II. I'll get him an electrolyzer Mark II. Oh, I'm running on small electric power poles. That's nice. Do we see any slow ones? Nope, no slow ones. Well, the slow ones wouldn't be down there anyway. We also need a lot more iron, but that's a different, at another time, another place. Anyone in here? Oops, 40 bad ones just collected. Nice. Got some bad ones yet, that one. I may even take you. Oh, that. Can I take you? Oh, got it. And you? Got it. Put it in here. So how many do we have? We now have 134, and I think I had about 150, 160 maybe of that. So what I need to do at this point is scale up here. Now I need to make electrolyzers. They also deserve to get a setup like this. One, two. Maybe even. Ah, uh, steel gears, really? Steel gears? So, electrolyzer mark one. I'm just going to try to work on this concept of if I need it, I'll build it here. The Mark II, and how many electrolyzers, electrolyzer mark values do we have? Let's go over here and say there's four electrolyzer mark values. So we'll just do three and four. Not relevant just yet. And I want that one. Copy, paste, paste, copy. Paste this one. Electrolyze Mark II. I don't think I want 50 of those. And I don't think I want 50 of those either. But I think I want 20. Those are quite absurd numbers. This one I might need 50 of. Just because. <clears throat> Behind you. <laughs> that is not a... That's a really cruel thing to say in... In a Twitch chat because... There's no way that I'm going to react to that response. 
in time at least. Behind you, look behind you. Copy, paste, oh, not that one. Ooh, now we have a problem on the clay bricks though. Steel pipes, we also have that. I'm going to give you half of it. Let's see, what are we getting in here? We're getting basically everything. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Nice indeed. What about here? We are getting all but the clay bricks. At some point, we also need the clay bricks to be sorted. Whoa, that was a mistake. I wonder how f how much I messed up out there. Uh, a lot. <clears throat> Oops. Oh, I messed up more. Great. I was actually not intending to go all the way, but I got carried away as I so often, so often am. There we go. I'm going to do it again. That's such a nice discovery. But... Good. Now we have a bit more space to bring. Ah. Right. Yeah, there was a small one. I missed the small one. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna miss a few of the small ones here and there. I'm just once in a while just gonna look out and just saying, oh, steel pipes. I know you're gonna go up here for steel pipes, right? So I might as well just throw those in there right now. Look at that. I have some things. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That's the scaven and me talking. And I know that I'm wasting a lot of materials just standing here all the time. But once it's filled up, it's just that. It's filled up and I don't care anymore. What else uh, do I need? I need definitely inserters as well. So maybe I should just make inserters while I'm at it. Yellow, blue, green. Yellow inserters, blue inserters, green inserters. There we go. And that one. There'll probably be more. We don't know yet, but there will be more. And again, these. Oops. And we lost all our inserters. Good. There, there. Yeah, and. This is some red ones, and uh, this is actually going to be a bit tricky, isn't it? Because I actually do want some blue inserters stacked up. I don't, I don't want to just use stack inserters. There's a way to remove the landmass again. Yeah, uh, it's waterfill, I think it's called. At least waterfill does that. I know I'm placing it too close, but it uh, it's a nice pattern, and therefore I'm going to keep it. Right. So what is going on here? I think I need to do that. This is not working. I'm breaking my pattern here. Oh no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not actually. I'm gonna cheat. Hold on, how am I gonna cheat this? I don't think I'll ever use the purple one. If I need the purple ones, then I will just get it, right? Uh, 
there. Yeah, and I just need something in a small box for me to pick up. There we go. This is Stack Inserters. Less than 50, I guess. We're going to get better ones later on. And copy paste. What are you going to do? You're going to take 200. Wow. Place the water where he was standing. What? Although you need to be careful with the water for. I was watching a stream earlier today and he used that and somehow ended with game over. Really? Yeah, I guess you can also just um, circle yourself in somehow. Okay, so that one is going here. Look how fast this is actually going. It's definitely just getting there. Copy, paste, add you. Right, let's uh, have a look and how this is working. There's something being brought in. I think I need to scale this up because I need a lot of... No, I'll just... I don't need a lot of them though. There. Need a bit of, a bit of iron. Is it iron incoming? Yes, it is, but only 108. That means it has been picked up. Look at the speed of these ones. They are so nice, that speed. I really like that. comes the next one there I'm just worried that maybe that's one of the slow ones that got it this is the risk at this point is what sometimes things will just grind to a halt because it was a slow robot that got the order one of the few ones see now I'm just gonna start picking everything up even if they have something there are the fast ones yep I don't dare upgrade this mod because I'm sure that Angel will take these nice bots away from me someday. Someday he will. And I will rue that day, that's for sure. Good. Things are moving up here. Am I getting some... Oh, I'm actually forgetting to put lights in this. Also need lights at some point. There, that works. This one is not working because... <clears throat> you could have said that. Yes. So now the inserters are working. We need a lot of other stuff, but at least from this point it, it works. More inserters. Yep. That's a slow one. Is there a slow one here? No. I'm getting used to their speed now. How many robots do we have? We have 125. I really like these robots because they are... They are not all over the place. So it becomes much more discreet the way they're working. And they're working at a nice pace. So I really do like these robots. You are a mistake. Why do you keep bringing... Okay, that's the slag. That's fine. All right, so... What I need to do is actually, I need to make, to move this one further down. For that, I need more landfill. I guess I'm, okay, that's a lot of landfill. We will just get, nope, we will not because I don't have any iron. What a cliche at this point. There's a bit of iron. Yeah, and of course I need to fix the iron. Ooh, I can get a Mark II radar. That's nice. I'll definitely do that. They're better. Go. And you will be placed there. Why not? That's a nice space we can claim. There's a better water placing mod. It's called Terraform. Oh, that's 
Sounds like a good thing. All right, I'm gonna start from this one, this place. What? That's disaster. I'm not gonna do that then. That's exactly what's going to happen. Coming out is not an option. We're not going that way at least. Get closer. <sighs> Damn it. <sighs> uh, they do not get any, they get speed bonus, but they do not get any, uh, what is it called? Uh, carrying capacity bonus. I wonder if that's enough to catch my silliness. Ah, a bit closer. Saved by my buffer zone. Hello, landfish. Fortunately, I have to be zoomed in this close, otherwise, it doesn't work. It doesn't go consistent. Got it. This is a really efficient way of placing lots of landfill. will be my buffer zone against my own stupidity. There. Just gonna expand it a bit more. Almost didn't make it big enough. Okay, and someone's coming to... In no, they did okay, already answered that. What? Is the chat being really slow today? I'm actually... Or have you all fallen asleep or went out for bio breaks and refreshing coffee and whatever while I'm doing landfill. It is a part of this mod and it has to be done. It's also kind of rewarding to pick up 5,000 landfill and just place it. I keep telling myself that there will be a time when I don't need to do this. On the other hand, at, at that moment, I'll look at my island and think to myself, it could have been twice as big. And at that point, it will be a bad decision for me to not just do this one. It's not that much effort, extra effort. Ah, it kind of is, but whatever. There. All right, we can now bring out the gun and shoot some landfish as we meet them. A lot of landfish we have here. work. That one needs to be upgraded to a Mark II. Ugh, this is disgusting. It's especially disgusting because of that one, but there's kind of merit to it because I could pretend that it was on purpose. Yeah, let's do that. Let's actually pretend that it's on purpose. Oops, that's too big. It's 
See, now I have to, I make it look like it's on purpose. Actually, that's not good enough, is it? Uh, do you think Angel is a sadist because he one day updated recipes while Arumbo was playing, so he especially messed up Arumbo's perfect ratio? Nah, uh, I think you're reading too much into it. I, he's also done that with me, uh, playing petrochemicals and done that. I, I think there's some part of it that he likes the exposure. Of course, when someone high profile like Roomba plays his mods, that I mean, who wouldn't want that? Who wouldn't wouldn't uh, be proud of that? That's kind of obvious. But I don't think he does it just to say, "Ha ha, I'm gonna screw over a Roomba." Don't think so. See? Now this looks like it, it was on purpose. Let's try the new road. Yeah, six electric poles driving up. Oh. And no, nope, actually not. <clears throat> Can I make a better one? Ah, when he added washing, yeah, he was... We did not speak for many, many a day. No, I was, I actually, I did not like it. And then I, I wanted to do the, I said I wanted to do the tutorial. So I've asked him if he could give me early access to it. And I made the tutorial. So it launched exactly when he was ready. Except he went ahead and changed it like almost immediately. There. So that by the time my, oops, my mod, came, my review came out, it was practically outdated already. Because he had added, I can't remember what he added, but it was, I think it was some of those sodium things, silly sodium things. Oh, this is not how I like to build. Nope, not going to be my way of building. Nope, nope, nope. Ah, oh, it doesn't fit. Doesn't fit. Horrible. Could I place this road one further up? I could place it one further up. I don't particularly like it. Oh, could I place it one further down? That wouldn't be particularly bad. I mean, there would be a bit of leeway on the top side. Uh, I think when he will add science and aquagraphy, he could mess around with some recipe ratios. Yeah, well, I mean, I mean, I could ask him if uh, we could get an early version, a copy of it. to test it maybe do tutorials on it for anyone who wants to to learn how it works or get an idea or inspiration or anything like that yep like this that adds a bit of solar panels at least and then I'll add that one here. Does it work? Yeah, it gives a huge area. Nice. And we need more medium electric poles. Great. Not enough ingredients. Oh, you silly you. I need a hell of a lot bigger area to build my solar panels on, for sure. And I think, yeah. What lined up so perfectly with the road? 
Are the top ones these guys? No, 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 no. We do not build like that. That is uh, too close. You need the road to stand on its own. It's all its glory. <sighs> but there is one problem. I actually like this new setup better and I will use it. So uh, you're going to kill me for this. I'm going to destroy all of, all of it because I rather want this one. This one looks much nicer. Look at this. That would be so nice to have it like that. All right. So let me just run around and do stuff here. I'll have plenty of fuel for my cars after this. One of the things where if I don't do it, then I'll get annoyed about not doing it. So I might as well just do it immediately and get it over with. Go nanobots. <clears throat> I'm beta testing, but why does tutorials on beta much? Because they never, I mean, you know that Gmail is still in beta, right? And I think that it's fair to use it. I think even YouTube might be in beta. So I'm... Um, Things do not tend to be going out of beta, and they're still pretty much the way it's going to be. I'll just grab... No, not even? Wow. I need more iron. I am dying here. Whoops, I do not want to back. I think angel mods, what I mod, uh, why move the road when we can move the solar panels? Exactly. I mean, the, I mean, are you new around here? There are no sacred solar panels. It's kind of dark with these solar panels, but, um, and I may just kill the entire base. Oh. Then start placing them instead. Why do I have this fish here? All bearing points. It's annoying. Uh, your iron backed up and is not smelting. My iron did not back up. Really? No, that can't be. Iron is not backed up. That's not iron. I think it's this one you meant. No, it is not smelting. Why is it not smelting? Ooh, that is... Uh, what is this? It's coke? Am I seriously not getting any coke? Ah, I'm not getting any coke. <clears throat> because long, long time ago, we removed the coal from here. And because we don't get any new coal in, we do not get any new coke. That's a bit of a fragile way of doing it, but thank you. I think most of it, I'm just using as an example, a lot of stuff from Google just remains in beta way longer than it, it makes any sense. Ah, again. I have too much crap in my inventory. Do I have an electric boiler and flare stacks and stuff? Yeah, keep going. Oh, look, someone placed a lot of solar panels on the ground. It's somehow they they can be compressed a lot when they are on the ground. Uh, they must, must be foldable solar panels. Come on, nanobots, you seem a bit lazy. Go, 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 go. That one. Yep. I actually think I could place these faster than my nanobots do. Probably not the... Uh, uh, not everything. Also remember, none of this is actually hooked up to the network. So right now I am running on fumes from a power perspective. There. Okay. When I said beta mods, it smelled it wasn't beta. It's true. It's true. It isn't. 
beta in that regard. Um, but that doesn't mean that means it doesn't. I mean, people are still working on it. So why wouldn't it be necessary to have uh, to also have some uh, some tutorials on it? I, I think that's very reasonable. I've done a lot of tutorials and stuff that is not relevant anymore. I mean, yeah, you also have to consider that from a YouTube perspective, old videos do not get a lot of views, even if they are highly relevant. That's something they changed a couple of years ago. So there is some kind of renewal necessary. And for that, I mean, if I make the perfect angel tutorial, then, then what? If no one's going to watch it because it's just not high on the ranking. That's a bit of a shame, but it's just the way it is. Now I need to make sure I don't do the same mistake. Yeah, the mistake that I... There. Then I should have room for one more of these big blobs. Oh, just the last bit. Go, go, go. And I still have quite a few of these left. I don't think there were many landfish under this area, but I don't know. Oh, there's a little actual genuine fish. Oh, it's not big enough. No room. Right. This one is a really nice module. Ah, can I jam it in? I cannot jam it in. I can almost jam it in. What is the problem? I think we should try. I mean, that one doesn't seem necessary. This one can probably be removed or moved somewhere else, right? Yeah. What? Stop the teasing me. Oxygen gas in pipes is incredibly annoying. And the reason is, whenever I hover over it just for a second, I see that red bar and I think, oh my God, I lost power. It's still not hooked up. That's something we need to keep in mind. Um, this is not working just yet. This one. Got it. Oh, I can't take that one up. Uh, what am I going to put somewhere? Up? Hmm. Right, that's going to be all of it's going to be consumed. So what else? What else do we have that I should not have? Lots of things. Go. Nope. 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 No. Nope. And I'm going to put that one in a big box of junk. Oh, that one. That one. Good. The solar panels, I will forget all about it. All right. Let's take this one. I can't make it that close. I can make it this close, I think. This looks awesome if I can put it there. There are some things that are not entirely ideal, such as Vestex. this one. We're just going to flare. And what about down here? I'm still missing a few. I'm missing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. That's exactly what I needed. And let's move over here and figure out what I'm missing. Definitely some underground belts or underneath these as they are also called. And then I picked up 25. Let's see what else I need. One, two, three, four, five. I guess I don't need to bring this much. I think this is kind of not relevant anymore. I will. Okay, this is, I could do this, do this. It's not working entirely as I want here.
That one, that should be better. What are we missing? We're missing some lights. Uh, do you heard of Sisto? Yes, of course I've heard of Sisto. Um, how can I not have heard of him? What about him? Um, he's recently started and he is also new to Angel Bob. He has a better understanding. Of course, I mean, Sisto is very, very good at designing. There is no doubt about it. And also, he is not quite as new as he would like everyone to think. That's my theory, at least. Because he has a lot of things where he just jumps straight to some conclusion that's clear. I mean, some of the times he is also saying, yep, I've been calculating this in advance, which is fine. But I think he plays a lot between sessions. That's also the indication I got from his previous setups was he is playing a lot between sessions, just preparing, preparing. And that's what I really enjoy about his setup. That he is um he's so meticulous about it. This should be breaking my power. Do we have everything now? Yes we do. Except I do not think I have enough flaring. It took me tempting to realize oh wait, I watch you on YouTube. This feels ironic to me since I clicked this channel up by accident. Oh, that's some accident. After seeing that it was C-Block and further than anyone I watch on YouTube. <laughs> right, that's cool. <laughs> well, I'm happy you stumbled in here. And Gold Dude, why are you shouting? That's great. Uh... Yeah, I'm I'm happy about it too from one perspective. I'm happy about it from another perspective. Yeah, it sucks because I was just uh, I just started playing it and was like, ah, oh, damn! Now someone else is gonna steal all the all the views for this because in in it's it's also one of those things where as a small time YouTuber, just looking at it and saying like, yep. I do exactly the same, and of course he has more flair, but he gets, what's 15,000 views a day, and I get 500, and it's basically the same content. So there is, there is that, and of course it's a bit sad, but I also, uh, I also see other people who have like 12 views, and they're doing amazing work, so a lot of it is, is about you have to build up, you have to... Yeah, you have to build up the community. You have to be consistently delivering high quality, <clears throat> I hope. And just making sure that you are out there. Let's see. Are these? Yeah, they're jamming down here. So I have to fix it. I would like some more space, but I do not have enough space here. Flare stack. Where can I make a flare stack? There. And by now, all played with that, and it was boring for me. Now I have new content to watch. Well, I'm happy to do that. It it is actually you're you're touching upon one of those uh, interesting challenges. Because, at one perspective, I want to be presenting something new, right? Oh, that one I can take out. That one I can take out then. Uh, I want to present something new, but on the other hand, if I present something that's too new, right, then I am alienating a lot of the viewers because it might be too far ahead. Because if I want to cater for someone like you, then you'll you'll find vanilla boring, and and there's absolutely no doubt that my vanilla done right is my most popular series. I mean, I'm quite surprised. Let me just search for it. Um, the vanilla done right. I did it like. Uh, oh, shut up there. I have ninety thousand views on, on the first one. I am blown away by how many views that is. It's completely out of character for what I can could expect. The 
These flare stacks are not fast enough. I think I need to do something different. Let's just check. Is this the same network? Yes, it is. Ooh, they're actually picking up pace. This is doing that. Okay. I'm really happy with my vanilla done right and it, it definitely is something done right because it, it the amount of views I got and the amount of continuous comments, it's just amazing. But on the other hand, if I just kept doing vanilla series, I'm pretty sure that it would be tiring, right? Just, yes, let's do another vanilla series. All right, I think this is okay, but you can see this is just crashing so hard. I don't like this. I don't like it. Because I'm bringing everything up there. While what I could be doing... Two loaders. Boom. Loaders coming right up. There. And here. Now this is part of the network. And all of this comes in. Good. So when this one gets full, then that will stop. Good. Red belt time. Ah, uh, well. Okay. In my opinion, I'd put you above, sister, because of the long streams you upload to YouTube, which have to listen while slightly focusing on something else it still requires more focus yeah and that's a uh, i appreciate that it's the underground is not hooked up really oh yeah that one yeah that's a fantasy uh one that is that just not hooked up that is a good spot thank you very much yeah that it's a uh, i think it's mainly a flavor thing some people prefer the long ones, some people prefer the short ones, and that's um, both are totally okay. Uh, I, I try to also have have some, oh, that's not actually a good idea. I also try to make these in between so that if you are falling behind, then you're not just looking at it and saying, yep, I'm eight hours of stream behind. There's no way I'm going to catch up. So having these other sessions where you can ease, more easily catch up. <clears throat> what I need to do, and it's not going to sound nice, is take all of this and move it two tiles to the right. Because I need to have the flare stacks, have room for flare stacks down here. Actually, I need maybe three, four tiles. But I'm not sure I want to do it just now. Now is going to be a power and iron issue. That's my next issues. I think I'll extend it over here. I don't need that much space. Let's start using this in a more reasonable manner. Something like this. There. Why not move it with one electrolyzer? That's a good point. That's a really good point. That's it's it's those kind of things you're really that's a I think it's called Columbus Act, right? There you are. You're just seeing the same problem and just looking at it completely different. I'm like, I need to move it three tiles because I need three tiles. And that's the minimum I can need or I need. But you're looking at you know, whatever. Just move it six tiles. That's a good point. Um I don't know, is it that robust that I can just do it that way? I think it I think it actually is. So I'll do that. Thank you. Much better point. Then again, with robots, it's not that big of a deal. What? I ran out? I ran out of everything. Not these guys. And let's go up here and grab some more. I have 200. I'm totally overscaled on solar panels versus accumulators obviously huh. 
oh these guys do not need to be there maybe like the outer one there and i also think i want this thing here go and go let's go up and get the last of it boom that's a lot of solar panels so if i could only get some accumulators which i think i could build in the not too distant future need more solar panels need more solar panels i actually think i could just if i just took out the one lane here that would be enough to feed it down there. Good. A math student in my second year of my degrees. Huh. Yeah, well, <clears throat> I think you wanted the radar in this area. Uh, no, I don't think I need a radar. I have a Mark II radar here and I have another Mark II radar there and they'll easily cover the entire ground. Speaking of math, well, that's also my background. I do have a a master's in could call it applied mathematics. I, it's actually in logistics and transport. Lots and lots of optimization. Look at that. Two point seven. How much do we have? We have four point seven in the network. Nice. That's good. Good. And this also look nice. It uh, it's more robust. Oops. Math nerds <laughs> being of a minus since it's like two class. Yeah. Um, so what kind of math is your specialty? If you're at second year of your degree, uh, is that a master's? Oh no, where's my car? Good thing Argraven is not here. Oh, there it is. This is an evolutionary cycle this year. Factory got on Steam, so a lot of YouTubers and people got to know about it. Model Factory is appropriate, so those new, they still learn Factory. Raven. The reason they started to get bored, so those you were. Yeah, and, and that's um, exactly that's it. Uh, but this is where you will reply with that one when I can't find my car. I'll put a bit of light in there. Uh, Mammoth, I think you're absolutely correct. I, I think that it's a um, oh, slow butt. I think a lot of. Uh, of activities going on and it's also because uh, because point 15 is old now right so I need to think about what I want to do next you want another slow one hey let's have a look at the batteries I'm not gonna just dive headlong into batteries but let's just have a look at it plastic bar not a problem lead bar plate not a problem sulfuric acid not a problem why am I not just making a million of batteries now? Make million batteries. Yes, please. I'll make a million batteries. I don't know why I didn't consider how easy it actually is. And of course, not going to be these ones. It will be the chemical plants. I will Right, it's chemical plant for pla for batteries. Yep, it is. Chemical plants. I can do one, and none of those. What else is it? It's I bet it's iron. I was just about to say it's iron. It's always iron for by now. I'm gonna do just steal stuff, steal my iron somewhere. Two, three. You're getting a Bachelor of Science. Cool. Um, there's a mod named Where's My Car? I wonder that. I know that, but I don't think it's... Um, I mean, I never lose my car, so it's not really for me. There are probably other people who lose their car. 
time and time again, but it, it so rarely happens for me that it's it's just not relevant to have it. Right? Was that believable? There. This one will be sulfur pouring out sulfuric acid. Where do we have that? Sulfur dioxide, of course. Sulfuric acid. And I need to find the same as that one. That thing here. Works. That one goes in there. Yes. Nice. And copy paste. That one goes here. And 100. I don't think I have these in barrels, but I will definitely make it into barrels. Oh. No, you're not slow. You're fast. I'm just getting used to this fast one actually looking slow. Hello, Raffin. Well, if you could excuse me, I'm going to die in a meeting. I'm sorry. If, <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Die in a meeting. Right, so here I definitely need a pump. To pump this out and just... No, I don't. Because I think they will actually do the pumping themselves. Uh, where is it? That one? You are going to put the sulfuric acid in a barrel. And for that, you are going to request something and provide something to the network. Yes. Input, output, copy, paste. 10, nope, 100. And you are not powered, and you are not covered by the network. You're covered by the network now. And I'll just create a few of these just to get the ball rolling. There. You are not doing much. Why are you not doing much? Here we guess it. That's oh no, that's sulfur dioxide. Why do I keep so much junk? Why would I want sulfur dioxide? Ugh, that doesn't look like sulfuric. <laughs> no, it does not. Okay, at least I'm happy I didn't start pumping it out. All right, all right, all right. Okay, you you guys, that's fun and all. Hmm, man. I was so sure that I could just go and pick it up and everyone would be happy. But just need purified water. I think I have this. There. Go, go. Now I just need to figure out where I have the purified water. Oh, lo and behold, it's right next to it. That is more than just a bit fortunate. Because this one is jammed, right? Yeah, it's jammed. Oh, what? No? The, ah, crap. All right, but it'll still go up here and, and work as fast as it can. There, it's not working because there's no power. Let's put this one here. And then take the one we... Maybe get this back in action. Put it on the belt, and now we can go back to what I wanted to do before. That is sulfuric acid in a barrel. Thank you. You are going to be... That one here. That one there. Inbound, outbound, that one, and okay, cool. Is it working now? Why is it not working? Oh, over dioxide. 
No, no. <laughs> <sighs> I'm blind. I am blind. Oh, I think this is this is Factorio telling me that it's it's near the end of my or it's near my bedtime. Ah, right. Do I have G W I V? Whatever that is, uh, the answer is probably no. Is it an STD? Then the answer is definitely no. At least officially. We'll try one more time. How many times does it take to make, or how many engineers does it take to make uh, sulfuric acid? That should be a more appropriate question. Now you're not powered. Boo. Boo. There. In, out. All of these guys in. You go there. Can you please make it? Make it. Yep. Okay. Well, it's not hooked up yet. There. Water? Water? Yes. It's going to be too damn slow. But anyway, now. Someone should be inbound to pick this up, right? Why is it not the case? Is this part of the same network? If we... L? Oh, why do I have two networks? Damn, there's a mismatch network. <laughs> Yay, third time's a charm. Right, and up here? Oh, that's because this network, this is exactly this network. Cool. Um, explains it. There. Now I think I only have one network. Yes. That's how it's supposed to be. This one is now requesting. There's 16 inbound. Once the 16 are inbound, copy, paste. Maybe I should have done this way before. 500 at 500. Great. That'll make batteries. And then I need to mark this as batteries. Copy, paste. Copy, paste. Anything inbound? Here it is, it's coming. Inbound, there, working. Ah, of course, you're not getting anything else because reasons. Should I, while I'm at it, I'm, I'm really contemplating just doubling it up. I think I should because I'm going to need a lot of this. Not that one. Can I place it? No, I cannot place it over there, but I can place it there. Right? That is the correct placement. And let's make one, two, three. Down here, I will pick up some of these, pick up some of these, and what? Pick up more. Got it. There. Yep. Okay. So now the next one is plastic. Oh, sorry. Gosh down it, water mod. It adds extra liquid recipes that move inputs output for liquid stuff. Oh, really? Get more bots into there. Am I out of bots? No, 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 I don't need, I have 20 or uh, 84 idle bots. So I definitely note, oh, I only from. Whee! That's such a joyous, joyous thing to do. Let's uh, get some kind of round number. Not exactly a round number, but let's get 24 more. There. Two hundred. That seems like a good number. Completely wasteful, but whatever. 
There goes the plastic. Nice. Let's just take some of this plastic and put over here. There we go. We now have batteries. Should I just go straight ahead and make some accumulators just because... One, two, three, one. What? What are, what are, what are, what are you doing? You're, you're taking stuff from me. You're, you're stealing my crap. I actually want... No, I don't want that. I don't want it. No, 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 I don't want it. More accumulators. But it's also just kind of disappointing to actually build accumulators at this point because... Yeah. Okay, let's see. Fast accumulator, high capacity accumulator, slow accumulator. I think it's the high capacity accumulator that's a good one. Let's let's just have a look at it. It costs let's call it twice as much as the normal one. Normal one has maximum energy dent capacity is five megajoules. This one has ten megajoules. So what's the point? Cost to double has double it has Double the input, double output, and double consumption. Yeah, so it's basically just double. That's pretty good because you can say, if I build this one, I will need half as many. And real estate is something we should be mindful of. So let's take 200 of these and, you know, this will stick just 200 of those. And as much as I like, I don't know how to make. Oh, look at that. They all look the same. High capacity. Go. Oh. There is a new video on Sister's channel about C block. Do I say goodbye to your stream? Okay, well. That's uh I don't think it's it's really going anywhere that one, but um that's fine. How long time does this take? It takes ten, so I will be one oh, I don't already have it. There. How many do I want? I don't want 1,000, but I definitely want... Let's call it 500. Well, I'm also going to watch it at some point because I need to see if, if he comes up with some brilliant designs as well. He usually does. So, all right. This is a great place. I mean, this is a... We have... I, I didn't even consider that it would be rather easy to make it. Did not even consider that it would be easy to make uh, make them now. So that's good. Let's uh, see how this one is doing. You just intend to fill this one in, up entirely. Yeah, you just keep going. And I doubt this one will really go down fast, but it doesn't matter. It'll just go down eventually. And the next thing I want to or need to fix is definitely the iron, the lack of iron, to be honest. And actually, like, let's look at power because power might be in trouble. Uh, it's still holding somewhat strong. And the depressing part is just muddy water, clay bricks, and turning the MK1 electrolyzer into M. Um, oh, I keep saying MK, but it's Mark 1, Mark 2. This stream will also remain in history of YouTube. Um, that's highly likely. Your quality comments will not be responded to immediately. So these guys are 5k and this one is almost empty. That means eh, almost everything here is the stuff that's being taken down here. And, yeah, and the same with this one. They always take the closest. That's just fine. I like the fact that they take the closest. But we now have 6 point. 5k wood pellets that's very nice and i think we are at a point where i don't think we are need to be worried about <clears throat> uh, about power anymore i need to actually decommission all of this all my steam batteries they have served me well absolutely without a doubt they've served me well now you have batteries what's the next goal well the next goal is scaling up my production a lot 
We also have a ton of new materials here that I have just not touched yet. And that's definitely needed in order to keep tacking up. Also, we do not even have blue science. Exactly, blue science. Blue, oh, let's have a look. I mean, we're not going to build anymore, but let's just have a look at the blue science. M2 laser array and atomic sensors array. That's all nice and fine. Oh yeah, require, everything requires nitrogen. So before we can even get started on this, I need gold plate. That yeah, We did actually look at this last time. We need chemical laser. We don't know what that is. With it. Methanol we have. We need naphtha. I think we have naphtha, don't we? And we need glass. Gold, glass, and naphtha. Those are the three components we do not have. Not actually that bad. None of them are, are, are very scary. Uh, does this one generate naphtha? It does generate naphtha. So I have... 400 barrels of naphtha. That's easy. So it's actually just gold and glass. Let's just for the sake of it look at uh, glass. There's an easy one and there are stupid ones. That's the one I want. Silicon ore. Yes, please. On the other hand, how do I... Uh, glass mixture. One glass mixture for one silicon. Two glass if I mix in lime. Ah, that might actually why it goes easy with mixed chunks and metal. Right, so I might do this one because lime can easily be brought in. And then I'll make it into molten glass. And the molten glass I could mix. Now I'm not going to mix some molten lead with it. I think I'll do this one. Hold on, is does this make any sense? So I can get one glass mixture for one silicon. Yes. So this one is going to get me this is 12 silicon. And that becomes two glass if I molt make it molten. So that means from silicon to glass through the molten process, I divide by two. However, this one is better. That makes absolutely no sense. Don't you see the same thing? It is 75% efficient to go straight from silicon to glass, but going through molten glass and glass mixture, I only get 50%. What? I mean, of course, that's the bad one, but I could also make this one, and then it'll still only be... No, this makes no sense. One silicon, one glass. That means one 12 silicon, 120 molten glass. That means this is four silicon. Four silicon, two glass. That's bad. Four silicon, three glass. This is better. Do it right, you're not a filthy vanilla player. <laughs> I mean, I can, I think this one is good. But why? I'm not going to build it if it's strictly worse. Ah, who cares about this, the craft time? I don't. For sure I don't care about the craft time. Because it's still, it, it still takes three and a half seconds per glass produced. Right? So this one. Oh, this one actually is interesting because it also gives me some other stuff that I have no idea what it is, but probably necessary. This one takes two seconds per glass. Research tier three. Yeah, that get, gets even worse. All right, let's look at gold just to, to get an idea about it, what the easiest gold is. That's chlorine gas. We already saved chlorine gas for this exact purpose. So that's going to be easy. And go, go. That's easy. Ease piece. And then you can use the glass. Well, it's clay bricks. Yeah, that is an option, but I don't think I, I need it for the clay bricks. Can you open research tree and see? Yes, I can. Then we look at the glass. There is a tier here, but I can't do it until I already have this in place. Fiberglass board. That's nice. Glass into fiberglass into fiberglass boards. And then we get liquid resin, my favorite thing. 
<clears throat> this is strange. It's a strange recipe indeed. Here I get... Ah, there is no way in hell I'm ever going to make this. This is the part where I do not agree with Angel. Because he makes these things, and I'm sure that if you go to Wikipedia and say how you make glass, it will say sodium carbonate and sodium sulfate and lime and sand, and it'll be, oh my god, amazing, that's so awesome. But considering how little glass you really need in an Angel's playthrough, I don't need to spend 45 minutes coming up and getting all of this crap put together in order to be 25% more efficient. There is no point. If this was something advanced for titanium that I need a lot of in the end game, then sure, but glass is just, it's so trivial. Alumina, mm, Alumina is not exactly easy. Hey, good morning, Angel. Good of you to join us. Imagine, Angel, imagine I've been sitting here for four hours or three hours and 43 minutes. And at, at the three hour and 43 minute mark, I'm the one I say, this is where I don't agree. So anyone who can agree with me for three hours and 42 minutes, that's, that's impressive. Or anyway, I will agree with for three hours and 42 uh, efficiency for the sake of efficiency. Sorry, Dubax, you are stepping right into that trap. There is one resource that is more precious than anything else in this game, and that's time, my time. And therefore, I will not spend my time on getting 25% extra productivity on something that I need at the total end of the game, maybe five, ten thousand of. Nope, no need, no want. There's a problem here with our call. For some reason, we are not getting anything in. Nothing being delivered. This one must be dead. Is anyone coming in to pick up stuff from this one? I don't want this one to be a pickup location. How can we just prevent it from being a pickup location? We can actually just prevent it by changing it to a normal chest. No, actually make it a big chest. Oof. That one and that one are no longer relevant. There. And that one goes here. So I want this one to not be a location where they can take from. This should just, every single bit should go in here. Yep. This is good. And that one's also Fine-ish. Right, it looks like there was a loop that didn't work. I'm going to take you and put you over here because that's by far the most important one. Let's see, where are we? There are two places to request coal. The methanol and that one. So if this one generally requests more, I think this one will take priority. What should we be requesting? We're requesting 500. So if the other one requests 600, that should be better. Good. I'll definitely expand coal and I have everything set up because this one is ready to be converted into coal. Very easy, but it won't be today. Oh, sorry. Someone is... Uh, Ah, uh, let's get and why? Why direct smelting of silicon better than first year of glass metallurgy? Yes, less suffering. That's why. So. The question is, why is it like this? Should we ask me? Uh, my answer is because Angel is evil. Is that a good enough reply? I actually don't want these guys to be... I'll change these as well. Ooh, hold on. I would actually take that one if I bothered. Yep. And 
I'll take something out here. Yeah, it's not working. That is not working. Here, I guess. Like this and go. Okay, and they will be going in here. Does it make sense? What the hell am I doing? What? That was so bad. No one saw that. Oof. Good thing no one saw that. And let's see, I will now make, this one is just for crap. That's crap, that's crap, that's crap. And that one's crap. Good. One coming up here and I guess, this is not feeling right, is it? No, it does not feel right. Oh, wow. Thank you for the host. Wow, I just got, I got scared there. So that's a pretty good balancer. Much nicer way of balancing. There. I don't think there's any problem with it. I think only... Only to the extent that this one should not go if Slag. Slag must be greater than 500. Like this, right? Good. Yay, I got scared. Thank you. <laughs> right. All right, so I think it's, uh, it's time for me. What, four third is better than, no, three fourth is better than, uh, okay, you mean four, two, three. Uh, if you are working on agriculture addition right now, consider adding a source of glucose. Maybe you want to add some kind of microbiology later. Huh. I'm nearly certain that well, that's the same ratio. All right, we'll go through that again with the glass. Yeah, so everyone's with me. Here, I can take one silicon into one glass mixture. Here, I can take 12 silicon into 120 molten glass. That is the same as taking four silicon into two glass. That means it's uh, starting with four and going to two. So a four to two ratio. However, this ratio is taking four silicon raw and directly making it into three glass. There we go. Better ratio for a simpler process. That shouldn't be the case. This is nice. This one is actually having a tough time keeping up. Okay, right. I will be wrapping up this session now. I'm, I'm kind of tired. I think we need a good progress today. Uh, even though we spent some time on just messing around, I think we expanded our, I don't think, but we did expand this part out here. 144 what are we missing it's iron or ironic ironic it is we're expanding a lot of other stuff we got our electric engines we got a lot of sweet lovely mark ii uh, angels cargo bots unnerfed uh, angel by the way now that you're here um are you releasing a new official version of this 
for this one where they have a proper name because I want to know if you are nerfing them, making them slower because I like them. They're so cute and they have a really nice speed the way I see it. So what else did we do? We, what else did we do indeed? We built this one. It took a while to do. We also expanded our base quite significantly with this part out here. Here, I think this was the part we expanded. A pretty good expansions as well. We also expanded a bit up here. And that's about it. We also just messed around with a lot of small things here and there. But it does take a bit of time to work here. I'm really happy about this one. Uh, it took quite a while to do the things we had to do up here. So next time it's definitely blue science. It's um, yeah, first gold and then and glass and all of that. So with that, I will once again remind you that I am also present on YouTube if you are not available. And oh, there's a version of Portal with Mark II. Cool. And you're of course welcome to drop by on the Discord as well. Let's uh, be a good time there as well, discussing Victoria and other matters. And of course, there's also the Patreon if you should feel so inclined. And of course, the YouTube. So. I'm going to thank you all for joining tonight. It was a pleasure. I like having these uh, short streams and they don't they don't wear me down as much. And that's very nice, actually. So I'm going to wrap it up. Thank you for joining and I will see you somewhere around. Yes. Good night.